A good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to more Neo The World Ends With You. Okay, so, guys, listen. I know I'm addicted. <laughs> I really like this game. I've been wanting to play all day already, and I felt like I pretty much just couldn't. Hey, Rindo, I think we could use a little tap in our step. I mean, it'd be nice. Then let me share a secret little psych I came up with while I was skating around yesterday. Uh, what is it? Supersonic speed, yo. Explains how you were moving so fast. Nigh imperceivable to the naked eye. And if you all sync up with me, I can bring you all along for the ride. Seriously? That'll f that'll fill my need for speed for sure. Beats can accelerate the party's movement, allowing them to race around town at high speed. Tap the, ser the O button in time with the music to quicken your step. Sound surfing can also give you groove your crew will boost at the start of battle, so don't be afraid to feel the beat. This is kinda dope, not gonna lie. Okay, I can do this. Okay, I forgot what our pins are at the moment. I also forgot that I can... ...up our... Shenanigans to higher now. Feel like we are getting more points than the first time. At least. I don't see how we're gonna reach that maximum though. Let's bring the pain, yo! Auto dodge there, B. Nah, 
I don't actually think we're getting more points. It's most likely just my imagination. Wow, that didn't hit. Savage. Nice one, Rin dude. I'm running seven. I need like a hundred K, six hundred K to actually make. Still alive. Stupid bird. At least Beat came back with this with his skateboard. That's kind of dope. Six. I think I brought seven, right? annoying. He actually nulled that as well. Explosion. Let us tread carefully. Didn't even pay attention if we were on 200 already. You're the you pleb. Holy shit! That's a lot of power points. You're done. Oh, those are big boomers.
Hmm. This one is an L2. We need to wait until. Nagi's done. I guess we're going with another booms. Recommend it. Hello. Is this one? Oh no. Wait, this one evolves three times. Sick. This one is new. Come again. I love the sight of having enough money. Look at Beat's face when he's totally happy. Let's try this one. Yeah, okay. Uh, no, we didn't get one of each. <laughs> Do this. Place your order. Man, I am now starving. Let's eat. Nice. I forgot something as well to open on my system for better volume quality. Um, that. Okay. Let's see. Let's grab as many of them as possible. Seven. <clears throat> Fred needs to get a better ability to level up. Serious? Here I'm like trying to make combo hits, but it's not really beat drops, whatever. But so far I can only chain Rindo and beat currently. Probably keep that in my mind though.
position. Great job. Hey, no stop this now. Most spectacular. Wait, did I get points for hitting him on the shield? Stop it already. <laughs> I don't mind the rhinos, they don't do a lot of damage, just depending on what you're using, they're very slow to kill. Okay, not too bad. So launch with Nagi, hit with Rindo. And hit again with B if he doesn't get cocked. Cancelled by anything. <laughs> A little bit less than before, but not too bad. This definitely levels a uh, lonely space warrior, the great lunar view. I swear, if he goes up another level, I'm gonna be and evolves again. I'm gonna be mad flipping.
game. As good as ours. Damn right. That was easy, yo. Let's see if you're still saying that at the end of the day. Oh, looks like we've got news. New Flash players, the Wicked Twisters and the Vira Beauties have staked their claim on some turf. Jillian wants off to a good start. Hold up, the Vira Hooties? <laughs> Hooties? <laughs> Cannons team. Precisely, she's proven herself quite the capable commander. Uh, what are we waiting for? We better get out there and claim our turf before they do, yo! Let's bounce! Wait. Who's gonna make us go all super speedy? He definitely skates to the beat of his own drum. Kind of reminds me of Minamimoto in that sense, you know? That's certainly not a connection I had drawn before. We are in to close my eyes and focus intently on their respective energies. Perhaps I might be able to extrapolate some similarities between the two. It uh, wasn't that deep. <laughs> Did I check this? Uh... No, I hadn't. Look at all the goodies that I haven't bought here yet. The gear is getting even uh, rougher, mate. To... Oh, wrong way. Uh, I need to go check the streets. Let's go to Tower Records, yeah? Let's move. I like this move. Let me think this through. Gotta focus. What Wait. to do? Scramble crossing around Tower Records. Oh, there's no um Happier with that one. Listen, I need you guys to gain style, okay? Man, I That's all we need. Style. Okay, let's have a look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, these wolves leave fire along. Good to know. Look at me. Thanks, my 
Okay, so landing beats and combos is improves the amount of points I get. Good to know. I wish I realized that like the last time. Come look at me. Taking a lot of damage here, by the way. I swear I hate these bombs, they're so useless. Just hit a hundred. <laughs> Seriously, again? <laughs> Take a look at me. <sighs> I'm in nine rounds, right? Ay, 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 we're on six. These guys are not that painful, thankfully. Back to the harder ones.
Holy shit. Um. I think I'm gonna have to dodge for a bit. Regain some HP. Absolute trash. I'm gonna replace this one real quick because this is not gonna do me any good. Fucking mines. Take care of these stupid dogs first, though. Take out the dogs first. The rest can come later. Goes better at least. <laughs> that was fucking disgusting. Let's try See, these were. Better, much better. Okay, this is an easy wave. Oh no, never mind. This is more dogs.
pieces. So we went into the bear fight afterwards with two doggos, I guess, right? No, not with the doggos yet. Up, nice HP back. <sighs> okay, another bear. What wave is this? Eight. Okay. Much better. Yikes. That was 10k in one chain. That is a shit ton. Wow. Wow, one level up takes a total of. Jesus Christ. Bolt's boar. Let me have a look at the bolt boar. Because that could be a move for you. Even though I really like the current one. Well, that wouldn't be bad, actually. I'm not gonna swap this one for the bomb. If I want to stack points, I want to stack points, and I can't use that there. Okay, um... Oh, 
seven chain should be enough. Our party is equipped to win. Give it to me, yo. We're on a roll. Exquisite timing. We got this. Wolves, wolves, and wolves. Are you hungry like the wolf though? No, definitely not. Drag search. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Take these fuckers out first. guys are easy. one is not all giving me that many points. Just be careful. <laughs> Life in the Matrix is as it is in the Matrix. The same as always. life and yours, Bubbo? Did you get your stuff that you were waiting on? in D&D. Today, two more failed death saves and it would have been over. Sag. Yeah. 
Yeah, I got this sound bar. It took me a while to set it up, but it works now. Good. Glad. Oh, so little experience points. Let's have a look. Okay, that's not gonna be a large fight. I should be able to do that with the stupid... Great Lunar View. Gotta focus. Absolute garbage. Come on. Shit! No more PC speakers hooked on my TV! points in these chains because reasons going in lurking mode food time enjoy your dinner bubbo Come on. Let's blow this shit up. Bad Wolfos. Chini. Okay, please just go level up Moonwalking Star Quarterback. Then level up. It will, though, once I do the last one. Over here. Then we can do Biggie. But first, eat. In the game. What you been waiting for? Wicked Twisters got more. Booyaka! That makes two, don't it? Two with. Yes. Time for another new Splash players! Ooh. Wicked Twisters and the Pure Hearts have each claimed a new area for themselves. The Who Hearts? Another one of our rival teams. Man, y'all names are something else. Came up with them anyway. Wicked Twisters was my idea. 
is supposed to mean, though. Uh, it's like giant tornadoes that blow away the competition. And they're also, like, scary and mean. Uh, well then. Are you trying to say you don't like it? Nah, man. I think it's pretty solid, right? I knew you'd understand, Beat. At least somebody does. See, let's go up that style a bit more. Oh, uh, you don't like this one, Beat? You suck. Here, have some defense. Nope. He doesn't like that one either. Beat. Oh, I was about to say, are you like me, Beat? You not like vegetables? And then this one soup he liked. Ugh. Soup! I don't like soup, in case you guys didn't realize. Might as well go a little bit ham. Right? If I get to so little from this. Exactly a hundred, never mind then. Get rid of this fucking piece of trash. Let's see, any other squares that we still need to do? We still need to do Never Too Young. But I don't have... I can't put more than one Uber pin on so far. Oh, we have this one still. That might work. Sound. Yeah, fam, let's go. Running out of points as well. Already on 45%. The map unlocked. It's not too bad. Okay. Hey there, dude. Anything new? Hey there, dude. Oh, we got Fight this one already. against Let's do this. you raise the pig noises oh these things shrink or split so to say but they suck they weak I destroy Back on the chain, dang. Okay. Let's move. Scramble crossing. Wait, is that? You could have future in cosplay, you know. Sure had me fooled. Ah, it's you! Wait, why is she all dressed up nicely? Nice to see you too, newcomer. Never dreamed I'd see your handsome face again. Hey boss, you know who this lady is. Please refrain from speaking unless spoken to. Is she another player? Don't tell me you forgot all about me. After all we've been through. Nah, you're right. I maybe I did forget. What? Yeah, that pose. But why are you dressed up all nicely, lady? Doesn't fit. <laughs> cool it, yo. I know you're that prissy girl. Things just ain't coming to me right now. Looks like even death is no cure for unbridled idiocy. Uzuki Yashiro. I'm a reaper, remember? 
Yeah, she's dressed up way too nicely. Doesn't fit with her uh, personality. Was even your boss once upon a time, you know? That's a new one. The question is when he was among the living or when he was a player. All right, I remember now. You're Pinky. What'd you call me? Yeah, yeah. I guess she got a, a promotion or such. Chill. Um, how was I supposed to remember your name when I ain't never said it? Well, let's make sure you don't forget it this time. So what you doing, Pinky? Here to mess with us players again? Not exactly. Technically, I'm not even allowed to do that these days. Things have changed since you and your pals were running around town. For one, a Shibuya Reapers are now something of a endangered species. What do you mean, Shibuya Reapers? Do you guys come from anywhere else? Duh, there's Reapers native to every area, obviously. Huh, cool. So I haven't introduced myself. I'm... Tosai Furusawa Rindo Kanade and Nagiyusui. As if I don't already know who you are. It's kind of my job, kid. I've been watching over Shibuya since before you could even write your own name. This town's in my blood. It's like she's been here her whole life, or afterlife, as it were. Hey, how come you by yourself? Where's Lollipop? No way that guy gave up the Reaper gig. Your guess is as good as mine. Wait, who? Perchance he means the Reaper with the sweet tooth? Yeah, that guy's always sucking on a Lollipop. You all know him. Sure do, I always just call him Candyman. Wait a second, how do you know him? Kinda helped us out a few times, seemed like a nice guy. He helped you? Nice guy? Remind me not to get on her bad side. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why you all... Uh, yeah, she got a promotion, obviously, and I thought that good for nothing was just slacking off somewhere. But now I find out he's been helping players. You're disty of that absolute idiot. I have to teach him a lesson or three next time I see his ugly mug. It would appear we have met the lollipop's lover's boisterous boss. Still makes you realize just how much Shibuya has changed. Me, him, and a couple of our others are all that's left of the old crowd. Even the game master is not from around here this time. Damn, almost makes me feel sorry for you guys. The job isn't what it used to be either. I guess that's just the way things are nowadays. But more importantly, where do you get off pretending to be Neku? You got me all excited for a hot minute. My bad, Pinky, but... I would phones coming back be good for you? Oh, you know. So you really ain't here either then, sadly. Not like I... it was... Not like it makes a difference with the room bringers on top. I doubt even Neku could hold a candle to their almighty leader. Sounds like a real hot shot. Anyway, enough chit chat. Time for me to call it a day. Try not to have too much fun playing our little game now. Pinky! I can't, I'm not gonna remember her name. It's Candy Manning Pinky from now on again. I knew I remind. I knew I recognized her. Looks nothing like my last vision. Oh, it's voice acted. When is this even? Is this another potential future? It's just like that dream I had of Shibuya. Crown control to Major Rindude. Hello. Huh? Beat then the boss already bounced. You coming? Oh yeah, coming. Visions. Your social network has been updated. Oh, now I can actually get these two probably unlocked. Brand synergy increases, given brand's pin power when using three or more of its pins in a single deck. Katia Koki. I liked her scampy outfit better, but I guess she grew up as well, sort of. Ooh, this place has five. Nice. Um... Oh, new enemies as well. Did 
chain seven. We want to rack up as much points as possible after all. To the attack! That's what he yelled. Okay, what are these fuckers? <laughs> Pingus! Oh lord! Stop falling in the obvious traps, guys! And when I say guys, I mean most likely you're the dreaming, because you're the controller, haha. <laughs> okay, you know what? We're just gonna go in here. Where the fuck am- oh, I'm taking poison damage like a fucking champ. That's painful. I got seven, right? Penguins. Level up couldn't have come any sooner. Super chill. Okay, we're back at it with the fucking assholes. Listen, I need this fuck you need to die.
Jesus. Uh, penguins and... <clears throat> the ever arctic treasure a masters Still got Regen. Did you do you have high enough for higher level Regen? We do have now a better fret boost. Uh, look at it. What was this? Fret defense boost or HP? Party strike. I want this one on eventually someone. Nobody has a hundred yet. Let's go eat some shit. Welcome. Chicken soup curry. Style attack. <sighs> you're, you're just gonna deal with it, Miss Pricky Pants. This officially puts the Rin dude on a hundred. Not the Rin dude. Point boost. Heck fucking yeah. Need 222 for this regen. And regen 2 is on 123. Increase your groove to 200% or more to unleash supercharged mashup attacks. Have a nice day. Let's, okay, have, a let's have a look. Uh, we got three, four. I guess I'm just doing a small one here then. Or maybe two at the same time. Okay, chain five. That's good enough. Oh, I forgot to change. Okay. Oops. Definitely did not intend that. Damn. Back is annoying me. <sighs> GG already getting hit like that. Timing! 
We got this. Move. Leave it to me, yo. We're on a roll. Take a roll. Let's keep it up. That's our victim. It's over. Great job. No foes can sell me. Or me. Don't forget about me. Who's up? This move is not that strong, but I'm fine with it, I guess. Ay caramba. Having an R2 on beat moves is really painful. That's where I'm actually starting to notice the drop. Shabby, I guess. I foresee no difficulties. Move it, yo. Did I do that? That's you sure did. Yeah. An adequate performance. That's like a CPS. It's over. Ain't no stopping now! We got this. Hey, not bad. Just doing my job. Nailed it! Not bad, yo. You're done for! Exquisite timing! We got this. Nailed it! Not bad, I'd say. Okay, last round. I think, right? Oh no, fight was last round. Let us take the shortcoming in stride. The effort Arctic. Okay, nice. Hulk Fang. Uh, I'm gonna put you back on. Because I still. Can't remove my Uber pin. This one goes so slow. Seriously. Anyway. Um. Yeah, I still think my best bet would be Gorgeous Gemstone here. In your case. We have another R2 that we could level. Yeah, only R2.
our quarterback. Okay. Gotta focus. Uh, four on one side and four on the other side. I think that's the plan we're gonna go with. It is shark domination again. Oh, nice. This one dinner open, dine and dash. <laughs> oh, wow. Let's have a look. in the bag. Cool. 
Okay, Scorpion. We get 200, right? Yeah, okay, let's just drop the bomb on their faces. How you doing, bud? Just be careful. Doing well, how's my favorite Yordi? I'm doing okay, I'm doing okay. Could be worse, could be better, but I'm doing okay. I'm enjoying my game. out a little bit more with what I'm doing. Just a little bit more. Are you feeling any better since we last talked? Yeah, a lot. <laughs> Thankfully. I'm still not completely better, but I feel better. That's what counts, right? Hey, Lizzie. I suppose. I suppose. <clears throat> Lizzie, are you happy that it's uh, there now? The yes, mistress, I'm a pervert. And that makes three. I'd say we're making good progress. Let's just hope the other teams aren't. Okay, I'm happy now with the pervert sounds. Good. She'll soon find out. Hey. Newsflash from Scramble, y'all. Can't believe it. All the three teams taken a new turf, all of us. And while I've got your attention, let me hit you with another update. Here are the total current turf totals. The Wicked Twisters lead with four areas, while the Vera Beauties and the Pure Hearts have claimed three apiece. As the boss always says, things really heat up, and for that I'll reward you with a little more freedom. Say goodbye to those walls that were blocking on your way. 104, Shibuya Hikari and Scramble Crossing are now yours for the taking. You know what that means. Direct confrontation with the enemy factions. So now they're pitting us against the other players, huh? Need to get a chocolate milk. Give me a sec, Liz. Back in my day, we took on the Reapers, not each other, yo. To be fair, it isn't always like this. Usually there's more puzzles. The struggle for territorial control is fraught with surprises. 
in the mood for another one cuz surprise here we are ah you're with the viral beauties we sure are sweetie thought we'd take a little stroll and get a sneak peek of our future turf such unfounded arrogance you want a piece of this pie you gonna have to fight as you forward yo Ooh, aren't we bold for a newbie what was his name again Neku I listen I ain't Neku the name's Yo! Chocolate milk time. Chocolate milk. And I'm a fine to make sure you don't forget it. Guess we're really doing this. Okay, how is the enemy group? Not too bad, I guess. Oh, we don't even get points for this fight. Sad. Here I'm going all out. Trying to wreck up points. Kill. I will be taking the milk later, okay? I can't drink both milk and chocolate milk at the same time. Actually, you know what? I think we're good for now. Let's get out of here, on Auntie. Ta-ta for now. Huh. I'll teach him to mess with the twisters. At least we managed to hold our ground. Hold up. Hey, wait. You dropped this. I'm careless of him to leave something so important behind. I mean, anyone could just pick it up and read all their- Oh! Sup? Okay, for the record, I'm not guilty of prying into their businesses because the phone was already unlocked. But it says here they want to take down the twisters. Let's see, they're gonna meet at 104. No, wait, Shibuya Hikari? The one without a restaurant, that's oddly specific. Okay, sounds like they want to avoid being overheard. Seriously? Exactly as they. Sumio Pure Hearts VP. Who the hell's that? I haven't the slightest. Yes, they're like Motoi's second in command. Honestly, I'm less concerned about the who and more about the what. It sounds like they're trying to tag team us. Feels a bit unfair. Shall we put a preemptive stop to this to their collusive What's effort? All I I got out of that was stop, but I say hell yeah, Penny. Well then, glad you're on board. Ain't like how they're trying to play dirty. Don't sit right with me. Let's go show them how wicked we is, yo. Wait, hey, wait, uh, that's the second time you run off like that. Hey, Rin, dude, what should we do with this? Maybe just put it back where you found it. Yeah, good idea. Don't want anyone thinking I stole it. Well, better get moving. Whether 204 or Hikari? That's the question. The one without a restaurant. Which one that is? That is uh, 104. I buy two kilos of Polish candy. Yes, I did. Why Polish and why candles? It's not candles, it's candy, Bobo. Read better. Polish priest gave me candies. It's like chocolate layer with jelly stuff inside. Suigen Void. Is that a new one? I feel like I already had a, s a void. And it was Maju Sage Void. It's not the same thing. <sighs> this one is still not maxed out. This one either, and this one either. Okay, can we, uh, we get so many points. Gee, oh my god, how the fuck am I supposed to get that many points? Jesus Christ. Wasn't that lovely? That is, 
That is a lot. That's all. I can get me times this enough, fam. You ain't gonna get no praises today. What you gonna get is a lot of pain. time is it by this point anyways? It's almost dinner time. It is actually dinner time, but it's almost dinner time. Today's Saturday, right? Yeah, okay. No candles, Bobo. Candies. It's not an... Any who's is what, because she already ate them all and she liked them very much, that's why she bought more. Okay, uh, we're empty. It's Saturday today. So many sharks. We're not dealing with sharks. We can't get points anyways. <clears throat> Unless we... Uh... <laughs> Follow me, yo! Well, already? You've got a lot of nerve taking me on, yo! Sweat for fret.
Bobo, are you not wearing your glasses today? Phew, this place is now ours. Listen up, new fla news flash, scramble slammers. The wicked twister's taken a new piece of turf, which means the Vera beauties are down a piece. Bummer. Canon can forgive us. <clears throat> what in the Hachiko's name are you doing you here? I could say the same to you, punk. Oh, or uh, forgive me, you simply caught me off guard. I didn't mean to treat you like a ruffian. Don't sound thoroughly intentional to me. <sighs> there you are. We've been looking... All over for you, girl. So bad news. It sounds like those icky twisters are onto us. Canon said we should just call off the whole thing. Uh, what is this thing of which you speak? I don't have any idea what you're talking about. Um, so useless. Um, were you trying to address me? Well, no, no. You must be hearing things. <laughs> Anyhow, I've got to run. Ciao. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, Bobo, are you okay? Um, Ruth, it's already bad enough we lost this area, but to lose it to those icky twisters of all teams? That's just sad. Ugh, I need a Cosmo. Their moral certainly seems to have taken a downturn, fine by me. Let's see how far down we can make it go. I'm gonna stop to their scheme was a good start. Don't get it, though. Are they all really that afraid of us? Like, us? They certainly emit an aura of unease. It's not a wise thing to... ...accept candy from strangers and slash or priests. Everyone knows that. Bubbo. <laughs> Lizzie knows the priest. It's not the stranger. She works at a church, remember? She sees this priest every day. <laughs> I was speaking to myself, but I heard it. Doesn't that count? Words must follow, especially when we're basically on the same page here. Strongly doubt the veracity of that statement. What is you two fighting about now? They must be on one of the other teams. This but discord between opposing elements. Uh, you mean like water? If that facilitates your comprehension, then yes. Question is, which one? Bobo's being odd. I agree. Well, howdy. Bobo must have lost it. His marble somewhere. All those abused altar boys didn't knew the priests. Damn it, Bobo. She's falling for it! Incoming. Greetings, Sheeple of Shibuya. This is your Game Master, Shiba, speaking. Hope you're feeling footless and free on day th number three. Got some red hot news for you. Is the brother running the game these days? Yep. I am pleased to see this turf war has kindled a fire in your bellies, and although it looks like the room bringers are cooling off today, their loss can be your gain. Don't miss this chance to climb the ranks. Never seen this punk before. Perhaps he's a relatively new reaper. Especially you, Wicked Twisters. Did you lose that spark you had last week? Quit your sulking and see if you can set my heart ablaze once more. Dude, find out overheat at this rate. We can only hope. 
After all, a game without white hot passion isn't one worth watching. <laughs> and with that, I bid you adieu. He's not a priest, he's an accountant. But how many drugs did you have today? They are even worse, trust me, I know. Because you're an accountant, Bobo? <laughs> Seems like our esteemed game masters had taken quite a shine to you kids. Ah, Gramps. Yo, you that reaper from yesterday, what you want with us? <laughs> Just want to see if you notice people looking at you differently. How exactly? Well, first you be big. Bad Susukichi, albeit with some outside interference, and then use late ways to that little powerhouse Tsugumi. And when you topple two of the two uh, of the top players in the game, people start talking, saying that you're going after the head honcho next. I beg your pardon. Wait, are you saying the room bringers are team a three man team? <laughs> yeah, but of course. Don't tell me you didn't know. Suzukichi and Tsugumi just do all the dirty work on their boss's behalf, so they sit out the turf wars because they're outnumbered. That's one reason, and now that nasty beating Yos gave him is another. The mere mention of your names got other teams shaken in their sneakers, although you can only go so far on reputation alone. The real question is, does you got the skill to go all the way? <laughs> Yo, Gramps. You. Ain't nobody could win the fights they won without skill. So how about you shut that trap of yours before they take you on too? And not a thing. Are you even here talking to us to begin with? Beats the bomb. Seems this is far from his first verbal bout. That ain't the tone to take with your eldest kid, so you think you know it and all cuz this is your second time at the rodeo? I know that messing with players is against the rules, yo. Got enough on our plates racking up points without you getting up in their business, so get lost before this gets ugly. Hmm, <laughs> kids these days, I'm telling ya. You. You'd all be long gone by now if you didn't have each other. No, Gramps, fighting with these three really helped me get back into my the groove. How about you and me go one on one and I'll prove it to you? Dude, you can't just pick a fight with a Reaper, can you? Well, it ain't gonna be no walk in the park, but even Reapers was players once upon a time. And besides, I used to be a Reaper myself. No way. Yeah. Okay, what, what am I already, Bobo? Of course, maybe. Well, this dude's cute, so you are basically saying I'm not cute. Bobo, the definition of cute does not suit you. If anything, you might be big and fluffy, but not cute. <laughs> a, a reaper? Yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa, easy there, tiger. Ain't exactly fair if I ain't allowed to fight back, is it? To the wise, though, you could have an entire team of X Reapers and still wouldn't stop the room bringers from coming out on top. Anyways, I'll let you get back to pretending like you've got a shot at winning. <laughs> I don't like that guy, but I do love his voice. His face and body don't match, but his voice matches his face so fucking well. <clears throat> Gone with the wind. Don't go showing your face around us no more, Gramps. So, uh, beat you were seriously a Reaper? Sure was. Whoa, that can only help our chance this week, right? Right. Max Reaper can probably do all thing, all kinds of things. Just a sec, though. How are you alive now if you are used to be a Reaper? Because I went back to being a player. That was the only way I could save Neku. There's that name again. Oh, you're like a page in the legend of Neku. Pretty cool, eh, boss? Well, I agree, it is unclear to me why my input is required in this scenario. So, were you too close? For sure! Me and him always had each other's back, yo. He was there for me at the end, too. Right when it most mattered. Would've put money on him being here. But I guess the odds was always slim. And here I thought I finally lucked out, making it to the UG and all. Now I don't know where else to look, yo. Sorry to hear that. Nah, it's fine. Open around ain't gonna get me nowhere. Anyway, let's bounce. Top spot ain't gonna take itself. 
took the words out of my mouth. You're the savage. There's still plenty of time, it's only day three after all. We just need to claim the first place by the final day. And leave this game behind, for, uh, behind us for good. Uh, we've got beat on our side, I think we can actually do it. <clears throat> what do you mean, savage? Big and fluffy, that's what she said. No, that's not what she said. She didn't say anything. Shibuya Hikari. Got all of these. Sorry, but you're no match for me. I don't like the fact that uh, with the tornado, my girl isn't popping towards me the entire time. I use it. It's kind of annoying. But I'll live. Who the balls? Who wants a piece of breath? I think we've got this. Do you? Oh man, 13 more seconds. The other teams didn't fare as before, they should now. Hey. Heads up, players! Got another news flash coming your way. The Wicked Twisters made their mark on another area. The pure hearts and the beauties must be reeling. They've both had their turf swept up and away by the Twisterinos. Can anybody stop their raging whirlwind of destruction? I've got a feeling we're gonna find out soon enough. Cause if I know these teams like I do, they ain't gonna take that kind of thievery lying down. Isn't thievery the point of a third war? The city's yours for the taking players, so get out here and grab it. And don't forget, the boss will be watching, so be sure to give him a good show. I don't want to be too doom and gloom. 
But I think it's safe to say the other teams be coming to take our turf. Sure sounds like it. So we just fend them off. Easy as that, yo. I mean, yeah, but it's two teams against one. One of them could keep us busy while the other makes a move. Good point. We're not exactly equipped to handle a two-front assault. And there's a very good chance the other teams are going to take advantage of that. But what if we were to meet our enemies on both fronts? Like, split up? Seriously? <clears throat> of course. But why? Well, objectively speaking, we Twisters are quite a, the formidable force. Hell yeah, we are. I mean, yeah, but seriously? She ain't wrong, we already took the other team's turf once today. And we showed the Roombringers who's the boss the day before. Guess you're right. Maybe they've got a point. I thought we'd be hopeless without Minamimoto. But maybe we're not so hopeless after all, especially now that we've got Beat on board. I don't know, we're still pretty sorely outnumbered. It was not more than a mere suggestion. Well, what you think, Rindo? Rindo. Me? You're the leader, ain't you? I mean, yeah, but I have no preferences as how we proceed. I shall do as Lord Rindo bids. Not gonna lie, I'm still not super sure about this. But I'll go with whatever Rindu decides. Well, you heard it, Captain. So what is it gonna be? Do you really have to choose? Sure, let's split it up. I think we can do fine with just two characters. We just need to make sure that one uses a charge, an R2, L2, L1, R1, and the other one uses the other. We should be fine. Right. Okay, let's try splitting up. I, now I'm gonna go with my boy Rindo. Uh, so that means Fred and Pinny is team two. Sounds good to me. Permit me to ask why he splits the teams like that. Well, I may have played the game before, but I was still getting back into the groove. So I figured I ought to follow the leader and have him lend me a hand. Just feel safer that way, you know? Feel to comprehend his presence in any way and ensure your well-being. <laughs> Meh, don't sweet the details, boss. Let's just make the most of it. <laughs> She really doesn't like him, so which way do you want to go? Let's see, the beauties be posted up here, and the poor hearts will be here. Pure hearts, close though. Whatever, we'll go with the beauties. Okay, so you've, you're you going to Dogenzaka and go east. Then me and boss will go after pure hearts, which shall take us to west exit and the express underpass. Sounds like a plan. Good luck, you two. I fear I shall need it. Do we get to a dit all of them though? No. But this is this should be fine. As long as we don't go doing stupid stuff by attacking the noise. But yeah, that's a good idea though, splitting up. Technically we should be powerful enough to handle. And if not, then one could keep guard on one side until we take out the other side. That is always my strategy, though, when it comes to split fights when we're, where we're, um, I want to say underpowered, but with less people. Uh, outnumbered. Because we usually got more strength, bro. Oh, this is annoying. Gotta watch out with our points, though. Take the sharks out first. Just follow my lead. I'll do what I can. You ready for this? I can just slay. Just follow my lead. I'll do what I can. Mm. 
Good. Follow me, yo. Quest doesn't work anyways, Bobo. Both of the area has already appeared. Jesus Christ. I'm all set. It's go time. Time for a beatdown. Who's up first? Go. <laughs> Heads up. Follow me, yo! Um, that was unexpectedly a little bit more range than I anticipated. But you guys are weak as heck anyways, I don't really care. God, this place is ours now. Sure looks like it. Hey, it's your boy coming at you with another news flash, and it's double trouble. The Wicked Twisters just played in two zones at once. The expressway area is ours now too. Fred and Nagi really did it. What's the deal, Twister Enos? Did you multiply or did you divide so you could add some more turf to your collection? I bet the beauties and the pure hearts are shaking in their shoes right now. Shaking with rage, that is. Are you gonna take that? Huh. They're gonna take whatever we dish out, yo. You feel me, Rindo? Let's move, Roger. Is the Vera Beauty's last stand. Speaking of the devil, yo, ain't that them? Well, 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 if it isn't everyone's favorite little superstars. ASQ. Sorry, kids, but if you think you're getting any further, then you thought wrong. Joke's on you, pal. I ain't thought a single thing since you started talking. Hold on a sec, aren't you that Neku guy? For the last time, the name's Beat, yo! Get it through your thick heads already! Here, I'll help you out, yo. Let's go, Rindo. All your asses is grass. Okay, we got this. Okay, what kind of extra noise do they have? Thanks for the help. I got you. I got you. you ready for this? It's party time. It's over. Just follow my lead. I'll do what I can. Going out. Let's wreck these punks. 
And defeated the level 100 boss and almost completely training ground. Nice! Good job, SQ! Leave it to me, yo. Just gotta keep it up, yo. Ooh, let me go to the store real quick, see if there's anything new. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. This is new. Bright Chords. Healing Aura. Will not refill automatically or reboot. Oh, that sucks. Thankfully, it levels up fast. No evolution. Max level 10? What the frick, yo? See you around then. 88... 89% trophies. I'm so proud of myself. Good job, SQ. You are allowed to be proud of yourself for all the hard work you're putting into the game. Hello, welcome. That doesn't make you already make an OnlyFans account. I don't know what will. Uh, yeah, that's a... Good thing to say, nothing <laughs> will make me make an OnlyFans account. That's the answer there, uh, Lizzie. Leaving so soon? What a shame. I'm all set. <laughs> a ver vera beauties, whatever. First, get rid of the four bingus. It's raining and the clouds are fighting. It's not raining. Also, clouds don't fight. Okay, we got this one open up now. Bulls has appeared. Hey, Beat. I'm pretty sure that's the area leader. We should probably approach with the hell this. You all ain't even gonna roll out the red carpet for your special guests, yo. Caution. You will once we actually get some guests who warrant special treatment. Pretty brave of you to show up as a duo, aren't you scared? Nah, we ain't. But you all be. Scared of a couple of drab dummies like you? Ha! Zone is our last stronghold. And as Vira Beauty, I will defend it with my la dying breath. We're the gang with a passion for fashion, and we won't lose to the likes of you. Big words for a small guy. Okay, let me think. What are we going to use here? This is... Oh, this is new. Spectral Swords. Um, other than that, the only things that I have is like things that are ubers and I don't have another uber slot. 
so I guess we're gonna use the... Where is it? You already... You just found it and you already lost it. You're so good at... Oh, here it is. Fast. No evolution. Okay, cool. Taking me on, yo. Just be careful. Let's go. Let's uh, yeah. uh, whoa, whoa, uh, oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. I did it. Yeah, I really need to get rid of this thing here first. Wondering if I should have actually gotten rid of the charge attack of B. That was super OP. Losing too many points this way. I don't like that. That's fine. Thor having a party? Nice. Or having a party, nice. I should not have dived in so soon. Waited for the combo to finish. Spectral swords don't do a lot of damage, but they're pretty dope. Not bad, I would say. Cloud should only have one night stance. Clouds fight. Clouds are like coupled in relationship. They get together, get angry at each other, fight, blood everywhere, then cool down and break up. It's a battlefield, yo. <laughs> we did it. We actually beat them. Some beauties just couldn't handle a couple of beasts like you and me. Gotta say, that was easier than I thought, yo. Guess you was right about splitting an op, chap. Well, technically, it was Nagi's idea. Speaking of which, I hope she and Fred are okay. Yo, Rin dude! Fred, Nagi. So, everything good? Better than... <laughs> God damn it. Hey, Hiko! Better than good. It was great. I hesitate to offer such effusive praise. Either way, you did a good job, and soon everyone's going to hear about it. Here we go. Flat Newsflash Grumble Slammers! Man, it's going to feel great to hear him call our names. 
The Farah Beauties claimed a new area as their own. What when? They took a risk by giving up their last spot, but the save paid off. Yo, Beauties are keeping it hot, and for that you deserve mad props. Oh, we was done for the day, yo. Perhaps the previous leader resisted as a mere diversion tactic. Miss your chance to make a move now, and you might lose all your turf before you even know it. Looks like they took the area around 104. Then I say we take it back. Seems like a good idea. Oh, 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 we didn't want that. Tread streets. How are you, Hiko? Better brace ourselves, this is the big one. You can see the beauties over there. And I can sense their murderous intent from here. For reals? I ain't feeling a thing. It's for the best, perhaps. She's right, though. Got a bad feeling about this. Don't matter what you feel, we got a job to do, don't we? They can't touch us if we get them first. Hey, uh, you with the Vary yeah. Beauties? Walk the fit kid who doesn't look like I'm with. It's about time you Icky Twister showed up. I've been waiting. The name's Maito, and unlike the other beauties, I'm long-lasting. Mm. What, what is that supposed to mean? Eh, long-lasting? I suspect his psyche is better left unexplored. So all we gotta do is take you down and your team is done for, right? Assuming you were capable of besting me in battle. Maita, I hope I'm not too late. Sumio, what are you doing here? Come to propose we shirk the rules for a moment. Indulge in a little immoral behavior, if you will. Uh, you're not exactly my type. Not like that. Take down the twisters, remember? As you likely lack the authority to broker this sort of negotiation on the spot, but surely Kanan would understand. You merely acted in the t your team's best interest. Well, why don't we take on these ruffians as a team? Now I've got a bad feeling. I swear you really don't know how to take no for an answer. Hmm. Fine, I'm in. Someone's got to put these icky twisters in their place after all, and it might as well be us. Oh dear, oh dear. After that, I'll go rally the troops then. This is seriously unfair. Whatever, man. Oh. It ain't about the numbers. No matter if there's ten of you or a hundred of you, you're going down, yo. My aren't we confident, Neku? I'm gonna say this one more time and that's it. Hey, punk. I ain't Neku. The name's Beat, yo. Now let's do this, Captain. Wait, right now? Okay. Just break them to pieces. We good. Got some Chinese food on my state. Subsidies got except so I had a four digit amount of money on my bank account. One point, a relationship down. consists of wait, <laughs> give me a sec, balls consists of a coastian ships and people who basically live in other country. Accountant tenses, I don't fucking know. Ooh la la, relationship with sparks line. Nice, Hiko. These guys are going to get absolutely clobbered. Because they weak! Keep it going! Yeah. 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 Yeah
I think I murdered that word. Acquaintances. That, okay, that word I know at least. As, sorry, living in a desert, rain and thunder are exciting to me. He could just say long distance relationship. Yeah, a long distance relationship in God. I don't believe in long distance relationships. Neither do I. Sounds terrible. Hey. Where is Maito and Sumiyogo? They bounced, I think. Whew, glad to hear it. But I tell you, ain't about the numbers, yo. Does this mean the battle of urban supremacy has finally ended? Probably not. Guess we'll find out. Attention, Scramble Slammers, got another new slash for you. Hold on to your seats, cause this is big. The Wicked Twister's taking all of Subuya. Never doubt you for a second, kids. Which brings us to our results. The undistooped winners of today's turf war are the Twisterinos. You really knocked it out the park. But man, what a bummer for beauties. They started off strong, ready to paint the town red, but they're walking away today black and blue. Just want to be over with, and you don't think there's another grand finale, do you? And that concludes today's Turf War players. Wait, seriously? Phew. I'm still reeling from all those twists and turns. I don't think my poor heart can take anymore. <laughs> Big shout out to you all for putting on such a good show today. Get pumped for your prizes and, and until next time, keep it hot. So, you're finally done here, or what? Yep, all done. I didn't have enough points again. Like, how am I supposed to get so many points? I don't even have enough points for the first Scramble Slam to get the prizes. I believe we got three friendship points. Booyaka! We really got a good thing going here. I don't have to say anything, I might. I cannot help but feel we are riding our new comrades' coattails. It's all good as long as we win. Honestly, I was. Hey, you got this, player, SQ. You I'm got this. I was three years ago, yo. My hero. Think we managed to take first place? Let's find out. The wicked twisters took home the gold in today's turf war, but couldn't knock the ruin bringers off their pedestal. Shocker. Give me a break, yo. They wasn't even planned today. Ain't no way they're still on top. Permit me to remind you they did defeat the target on day one. Right, but that's the only day they earned any points so far. I've got a feeling that we can turn the tables, especially now that we've got beat on our side. I wondered when I might run into Rindy and the gang. Hey there, Kanon! Oh, and you must be the one everyone thought was Neku. Yep, that's me. Name's Beat, yo. And I'm guessing you ain't on our side. So what? You wanna go? Whoa, Beat, chill out! Why? Ain't she our rival? Technically, but the game's done for today. Oh, word. I see you too. With my social awkwardness, but I managed to keep that up long distance. Join the team. You sure know how to pick them. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. So if you ain't here to rumble, then why are you talking to us? Well, you see, I've got a proposal. Uh, for us? Mm-hmm. All four of you. Well, we'd love to hear it. Thank you, Fred. Ever the gentleman, I see. Let me cut to the chase. Why don't we work together? Quick? We all know this game is rigged. Sure, but... I think it's high time we set things straight. But how? By kicking the Ruin Ringers into last place. But... Wouldn't that get them erased? Alright, lady. I'm listening. Don't they deserve it for cheating their way to the top? A valid point. Hold up. When they cheat? When didn't they? Remember what happened at the end of last week? There's no way to win if we keep playing by their rules. If we want a shot at the top, we've got to take them out, meter and all. And in order to take them out, you're gonna need our help? Exactly. We'll wait until the final day, so as not to arouse any suspicion. The ruin brings Gaming gods, when I lost against the last bolt, I could just retry instead of doing it all over again. Nice. And I won't let that happen. Sure. 
I'm buying what you're selling. You've managed to come out on top against those thugs twice now. With the right kind of backup, I bet you could go one better. And what precisely might better entail? You'll find yourselves in first place, free to leave the game. Which leaves you... Facing off against Motorway the following week, I guess. So then, what exactly do you get out of this plan? A fair fight. I can take losing if it's on a level playing field. Spoken like a samurai. Thanks, I think. Kanon, are you serious about this? You're not trying to trick us or something, are you? You really think I would do something like that? It's just, it sounds like you're willing to do anything to win this game. You're not wrong. Especially knowing my life is on the line. I like to have fun, but I know when it's time to get serious. <laughs> right. Ultimately, whether you believe me or not is up to you. If we were to defeat the Ruin Barriers leader, would that guarantee another team could take first place? I can't say. You kidding me? But I can say that if taking them down changes nothing, then we're all out of hope. So you're saying this is really our only option? I'm afraid so. Well, how about it, Rindy? You're getting a pretty sweet deal here. Even Motui will end up better off than he is now. It's win, win, win. <sighs> Come on, this game's been bugging out for long enough. I say it's time we hit the reset button. I mean, that's the plan anyways. Clouds gather at the horizon, on the horizon. A storm brews, an unwelcome conclusion hides within the veil of possibility. Caution should be exercised towards those around you. Excuse me? Would it kill you to give me some good news? So what am I supposed to do? Sloth will not serve you, it is your own actions that speak louder than any words. Ugh, you know how much I hate these riddles. I gave you my money, now give me the tea. The cup overflows with expectations to the rule. Records of the past lose their meaning. Invited guests appear before me of late. So? Alright, that's enough. I'm out of here. Shoka, just be careful. It's dangerous here. Got it. Ciao. Oh, little kitty getting her fortune told. <laughs> and what about it? Nothing, just that all the other Reapers seem anxious about the future too. Something about those tricky twisters must be setting them off. Meh, huh. it's possible, I guess. Probably better to keep an eye on those bozos. Ooh, Kai Uno. Sound Surfer. Why is this game so frickishly good, guys? Day four. Three more days of week two. What's up, Fred? Just thinking about what Kanon said yesterday. You mean Operation Ruinbringer's gonna get got? Still don't know much about that lady, but I dig her way of thinking, yo. We got duped so many times back in the day. We took on each mission as it came. And those Reapers played us like a banjo every damn time. Just as we were played at the end of last week. Yeah, makes sense. Especially given what Kanon was saying. I know we told her we needed to mull things over, but I think we should go for it. What do you say? Lord Rindo, we mustn't forget the words of the Sweet Toothed Reaper. He stressed the importance of discerning who has our back. <laughs> or who wants to stab it. Kanon doesn't seem like the stabby type to me. I mean, me neither, but... If anyone's gonna backstab us, it's the Reapers. And if this game's like the one we was playing, then the whole thing's bogus with a capital B, yo. The whole thing? Well, what do you mean? Turned out we was playing to stop Shibuya from getting erased. Seriously? They said they used the game to search for peeps good at using sites. But that's a load of bull. Yeah, Candyman called it a talent show. Except there wasn't no fancy prizes. And one wrong move meant Shibuya was done for. Aha! Uh -huh. At long last, the dots have been connected. Total disaster nearly befell the city three years ago. Oh, right! That thing Kanon was talking about! When Neku saved the day. I'd be fine just racking up points. If doing that meant we could actually win. <sighs> Something tells me that's not how things work. Otherwise, we would have taken first place yesterday. Huh? 
Speak of the devil. Today we've been asked to... Ooh, what's this? Unravel the city's riddles and report on your findings. A mystery set in the city. Or is the city itself the mystery in question? What's the question? If one has to ask... We'll figure it out, yo. You know, B, you kind of remind me of me. I feel that. Thing is, the boss treats you differently. I don't get it. Hmm. I wonder if Swallow's replied yet. I do not inherently despise all who dwell in the light. What you mean, the light? Still nothing. The world in which you live. It's the same as yours. Don't know about you, but I live in Shibuya. Corporeally speaking, yes. Are you listening to me? <laughs> I don't know. It's not that I don't trust Kanon, but she made it sound like going along with her was the only way to avoid erasure. <sighs> what are we supposed to do? I'm yet unsure which is the quickest path back to the RG, or if it is even possible to return there at all. But oh, how I long for the latest chapter of Elastra. <laughs> So, where are we supposed to go find these rules anyway? If her phones are to be believed, we should be well served by heading to Tipsy yes. Toe's home. Sounds mm -hmm. good to me. Nice of him to just tell us where to go like that. Today's mission will be over before we know it. Unravel the city's mysteries. Let's have a look. Everything looks fairly open today. That's good, I guess. Okay, give me a sec. Beer beep. <laughs> no fappin', says Hiko. Hiko, I last longer than that. sucks.
Easy clap. Yuri is always flapping his wings like a flappy bird. I think we'll put beat on the cold bore. Gotta focus. Let's move. For the time being. You guys got nothing new, liars. Yeah. Thanks. Let's move. Uh oh. Come on now, you kids know the drill. You've gotta take care of a little mission first if you want past me. I bet you already know exactly what I want you to do. Let me guess. Revel the city's riddles and report on yeah. our findings. Bingo. You'll be reporting to me. Now let's get to business. The riddles you need to look into are urban legends. Ooh, I can't get enough of those. This is gonna be fun. I'm not talking just any old legends. Oh no. I mean the dankest ones in the seven districts. It's up to you to uncover the two spooky for TV truths behind them. Gives me goosebumps just imagining secrets, what secrets are out there. Anyway, I'll give you points for each juicy nugget of information you bring me. Rack up 100 points and I'll step aside. We just, like, look up all the answers on our phones right now. I thought you might say that. Seriously, players these days can't take their eyes off their damn phones. I see. Hmm, I see you're, you've taken the necessary precautions. All of the most famous videos on the subjects have been deleted. Haha, well. <laughs> that wasn't us, kid. Those videos were removed because they got too close to the truth. So you're saying the person who uploaded those videos was on something, huh? Fucking hell, I conquered the Netherlands and doubled my income. Oh yeah, playing some EU oof, AU4. Good fit stuff. You doubled your income just by purely conquering the Netherlands. Impressive. Let's look it up. Mmm. March is stream. Ostensibly a famous expert on the occult. Ahem. Uh -huh. Hmm? Apparently his hobby includes living in stigmatized properties and uploading videos. His first videos, well, video to go viral was all about urban legends. He even appeared on TV a few times, huh? Guess he is kind of famous. Hey. It sounds like it's my time to shine. Oh, words, your psych's perfect for this, yo. Like you've got a plan in the making. Just don't try and pull any fast ones on me. I know I'll feel be lying. Mm. 
eating something and hoping that the dialogue speaks for itself. <laughs> <clears throat> so there's supposed to be some kind of legend around here, huh? Apparently, yet I've tried a variety of terms. My searches have been fruitless. It seems all information was indeed erased. Guess that Reaper was right about her phones being no use. Alright, Flat, you know what to do. Hey. You good? Uh, oh, my bad. Got a little lost in thought there. Dude, this isn't a... A gay... Well, you know what I mean. Just focus, okay? Mm, I am focused. Thank you very much. I was just thinking about our team's future. Anyway, let's do this. Gotta think about urban legends and our man... Matcha stream. Let's have a look. So what are we thinking here? Try to remember. At least in this universe you don't have to be ruled over by the Spanish or the Dutch. What's that supposed to mean? I know we are a small country, and for that reason we take over a lot of things to compensate for our very smallness. But German is a shite language. Yes, but Dutch is better than German. At least Dutch I can understand. German I don't. I believe in myself. How I understand it, my peasant republic is all so <laughs> the union of sta sta and what? So you can probably still speak Dutch locally, but the official language will be German. Wait, you can repeat to the last now? <laughs> Savage. Donuts are nice. Gotta focus. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
Thanks. Gotta focus. Let's have a look. Gotta focus. Let's have a look. Longing for love. I kind of want to check out the urban legend on Center Street. Ma Chastri was talking about the one where people step into changing room and suddenly disappear. A guy working at Hawkfang was a total hunk, and the fact that he's so shy is like super adorable. Although the guy at uh, Gada Gada is pretty dreamy too. This is the most troubling story. <laughs> Changing rooms are supposed to be sacred places. You think somebody's been kidnapping peeps? Who knows, we might find out if we check out the store ourselves. What are we waiting for? Let's head to Hopfang. Sounds good to me. Ah, the summer just screamed. I wanna scream and shout. Excuse me, we just heard a pretty loud noise and... Uh, uh, oh, hey. Hey, so like I was saying, any idea what that noise was? No, it's just the customer. They One minute they were trying an outfit and the next they were gone. Huh? So you're saying, you have been vanishing after using your changing rooms? What's that, Yordi? I need a drink with your snack. I first need to do kills, get the milk, milky drink. How did you know? Hey, it's true. Could you tell us a bit more? Sure, so it's just a second ago this person was, you know, trying on some clothes. And then they left the changing room and made for the exit. I went after him, but they just vanished into thin air. You're sure they didn't just walk out the door? Positive. This uh, head scratcher, all right. You think? No, never mind. You think it's? You can't leave us hanging mid sentence like that. Well, it's been it has been happening a lot around here lately, which means. But a good chance it's gonna happen again real soon, maybe. Thanks, come on team, let's move. Be sure to buy something next time, buddy. Oh, that'd be great. There aren't many other stores we can actually go inside. Let's give this one a try. <coughs> it's the players that do that. <laughs> well, people are getting plenty of use out of those changing rooms. There goes another one. And he's heading right for the action. He hasn't even paid yet. Fishy to say the least. Come on, let's go after him. So was that size okay for you, sir? Hey, where are you going? Hey! What the heck was that? Look, the thief just left the store. And there's a clerk. It's like he vanished into thin air. Am I going crazy? Uh, he's right in front of you, ma'am. I thought that was a guy. 
Looks like our culprit is player. Oh, which why the cleric can't see him. Oh, I give up. Do you suppose that person is the origin of the urban legend? Maybe, but I still want to know what that brother's deal is. One way to find out. Let's ask him. Got a minute. Excuse you. Oh, and what do the icky twister want with little old me? You're a player, right? What team are you on? <laughs> I guess there's no harm in telling you. I'm with the Vire Beauties. Hmm. Don't start anything with Camel's team. Wonder if she knows about this. Huh? You got some to say, or? Uh, come on, spill it. You pay for those clothes. Um, are you stalking me or something? Don't make me ask again, punk. If it's fight you want, I'll gladly obliged. Great, just great. Okay, I can do this. Let us tread carefully. Let's go. Why is this mission weird, SQ? I'm pretty sure this is another one of these missions, just like in the first game. Where people or players or reapers do specific things and that turn into urban legends. I'm sorry, okay? I've just been stressed out lately. I figured a little retail therapy would help. But still counts if you don't actually pay. Well, Look, I won't do it again, I promise. I just couldn't help myself. The second I realized I could take the clothes and disappear, well, I had to try it out at least once. Mm. Mm. Those days are behind me. I'm so over it. You sure about that? 100%. Honestly, it's more trouble than it's worth. I even return all the stuff I stole too. You better. What's got you stressed out anyway? Been fighting with your friends or something? No, we're fine. I'm just tired of this gross game. This all. Okay. You won't understand. It's only your second week. Anyway, I'm outie. Don't want the gang to miss me too much. Seriously, yo? Hmm. <laughs> you better pay next time, yo. <sighs> Feel him though. <clears throat> this game really wears a brother out. Still doesn't excuse him shoplifting. Not in my book, anyway. 
I mean, paying the price is part of what makes shopping so fun. The only thing that beats finding a good bargain is saving up for something you can't buy right away. You feel so accomplished when you finally get what you wanted. Oh well, none of that matters right now. I see. I concur. Mm hmm. Or a Calican. Well, well, if it isn't my favorite team. Pinky! Hey there, Izuki. Pinky, what you doing here? Just checking in to make sure you're playing the game like you're supposed to. After all, it's my ass that's on the line if you love the site to slack off, you know. Sounds exactly like you sound exactly like Shoka. It's like you guys are babysitting us or something. Back in my day, being a Reaper meant getting your hands dirty. Now you just a bunch of security cameras, yo. You wanna say that again, pouty face? I miss her scampy outfit. I keep saying it. It's not like sitting on the sideline, I'm sitting on the sideline because I want to or anything. It must be tough following the rules when you're used to making them. Anyway, Pinky, there's something I want to ask you. Well, how come I'm here, you know, in UG? Did you hit your head after the last game? It's off. It's because you died, obviously. See, that's what you think, right? But I ain't even close to dead. Wait, say that again? I'm serious this time. Well, normally you remember dying, right? But I can't remember nothing. The only one that didn't remember dying was Neku. And he sacrificed his memory of his death. No, he didn't do any of that, actually. And I don't feel like I'm forgetting nothing either. If that's true, and let me be clear, there's no way it is then you'd be violating the rules of reality just being here. It would be like you never existed in the RG at all. Like, never existed ever? Wait, if is that possible why all our posts disappeared? Don't tell me you three are in the same boat as him. Unless our merry group has likewise nary any recollection of our ultimate... Oh, uh, untimely demise. What's this? What's going on here? This is above even the Game Master's pay grade. Only the Composure could really deal with a romance like this. If your hypothesis is indeed correct, would we be capable of returning to the RG eventually? Honestly, I couldn't say either way. And sir, nobody wants to hear. Maybe they play by a different set of rules in Shinjuku. Shinjuku? The city that got erased three years ago, yo. What do you mean erased? How can a whole city just vanish? Like an ancient civilization that fell into ruin, perhaps? Right, you were in the RG. Of course, you wouldn't know. But I knew Pinky. I saw the whole thing. Which could only... Which you could only do because you've been to the UG before. All over again. Simply put, Shinjuku was a city that got wiped out three years ago. It was just north of Shibuya, and you know. Was it? I don't remember that. Yeah, I think we'd know if there was something getting destroyed right next door. Actually, you won't. The second Shinjuku vanished, your memories of it followed suit. 
like a brain's got wiped. Basically, as far as the RG inhabitants are concerned, Shinjuku never existed. This is way creepier than those urban legends. And the Reapers who watched over Shinjuku back then are the same ones running the show in Shibuya right now. You just let them rock up and take over without a fight. It wasn't quite that straightforward anyway. Normally there'd be some kind of penalty if a living player took part in the game. But rules never meant much to Shinjuku gang. Nothing they do would surprise me at this point. Either way, something's gotta change around here or you all wind up the same as Shinjuku. You mean it'll be like we never even existed, right? So I'd focus on picking up points instead of moking around if I were you. This convo has been real downer. Time to get my ramen on for a little pick-me-up. Bye-bye. Well, that was quite the revelation, though it does explain why I have not received word from my friends or family. So even if we finish it first, we still don't know for sure if everything will go back to normal. Thought of perishing without first playing the latest Elstrad chapter is too much to bear. Can do nothing about it right now anyway, let's just focus on picking up points. You've got a point there, Beat. Let's check out those other areas. We can't ex exist in the RG no matter what we do. What the hell is this game? Huh. Something up front? Yeah. I've never seen anything like this before. Like, it's noise. At least, I think it's a noise. Someone else can it. I mean, I can. Let me have a look. Ooh, this is a pale one. What the hell? We haven't run into any pale enemies yet. Just the blue ones. Oh, what? I can't hit him. Away with you. Freak! Oh. Well, it's most fortunate and that's those beasts chose to beat a hasty retreat. Couldn't even make him flinch. Never seen anything like him, yo. Frankly, I'm not sure those creatures were noise at all. Good point. All according to plan. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay, we got a space for another L2 leveling. Oh, this is a frozen one. This one doesn't evolve. Good. <sighs> okay. Yeah. So you kids got any tasty morsels of information for me? Do you want to hear a story about Sun Street? Oh, local legend. Okay, kid, lay it on me. This one's about uh, some ghastly changing rooms. Apparently, if you use changing rooms at the clothing store on Center Street, you vanish the second you leave the store, never to be seen again. Yeah, I've heard that one. All right. So what was going on? You see, the thing about that is, um, we tell him that the Vara Beauty is behind it. it will get him in trouble. Will that get him in trouble? There's still a chance we might team up. Maybe we should mas massage the truth a little. So the person who disappeared was actually from the UG. They went to a store that serves players and tried on some stuff. And then they left without paying. Well, that won't do. One of the store clerics chased them as far as the exit too. And that's when they saw the thief vanish before their very eyes. Right, okay, that makes sense. Did you find out who the perp was then? Sadly, no. Hmm. Well, you win some, you lose some. Either way, it's time for me to pass judgment on your truth. Great. I believe you, that matches up nicely with what I heard. Uh... What you heard? You mean you already knew the truth this whole time? Not in so many words. Plus, there's always more to learn, even when you spend every day looking into this stuff. Barney is creepy. What does Barney have to do with it? Pinky and Lollipop, best reverse truth. It wouldn't hurt to ask you kids to help out. You're bound to find something I overlooked. 
Documenting urban legends is my death's work. Come on, I can still count on you, right? I guess so. I'm sure we'll see you again soon enough. Oh, wait, there's one more thing I need to tell you. You've just earned yourself 30 points. Of course, I'll happily lend an ear if you got more stories to share. So leave no stone unturned in your search for the truths. Oh. Okay, Spain Hill. This place is supposed to have its own legend, right? I believe so. However, any information related to it was erased hours ago. Who knew the Reaper's influence extended to even the digital realm? Dang. Let's hope Psyche can work it out. You really think focusing on same things every time will work, though? Assuming said, assuming said are urban legends and machas three, then I imagine it will. The memories they awaken should be connected to the present location. Basically, we're in the right place if we want to learn about Spain Hill's legend, right? Come on. <laughs> Boss, you you answered my question. I'm gonna cry. Use your psych first, cry later. Alright. Focus for it. Let's have a look. Gotta focus. Let's get down to business. I don't like this very much. It's very annoying. Come on, think. A man in purple dinosaur suit forcing you to say I love you to him. Monthly shop. Let me go do some killing while we're at it. Totally normal. Like a boss! Like a boss! Take a look at me! Da -da -na -na -na. What will he do next? No sweat 
606 Where was the girl? Oh here. Monthly shop. Hmm. Machistry said anyone who sets foot on the 18th step of Spain Hill stairs goes straight to hell. Let's just go up without counting. Can't wait to splurge up. Parco, spending all my money from my part-time job in one go is my favorite way to de-stress. <laughs> spending all my money in one go sounds like a terrible idea. I can't read you. The tournament rules said enemy can be defeated once downed. I read it as drowned. GG, sounds like we gotta check out Spain Hill Stairs, yo. Set foot on the 18th step and go straight to hell. Alright, who knew eternal damnation was so close at hand? Close enough to see our for ourselves, let's go. Nothing like spending a grand on hookers, I mean what? Hiko, you would do that. Okay, start counting. Hey, Rindut, is there like a reason for us to do this together? Well, how do you want to do this then? The only way to avoid infighting is to ascend as one. Now stop being so childish. I let's do this. Here goes. When I'm not that desperate yet. You would spend a grand on magic cards, though. I bet. I mean, I would spend a grand on Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I bet you would spend a grand on magic cards. See, we guys are totally normal. Definitely not. 16, 17, 18. Whoa. You all right? Yeah, just tripped, so... The step slip guard is conspicuously absent. Explained why be tripped. Wait, is that it? Oh. You okay? How? You fell over so suddenly. You scared me half to death. Look, the slip guard's gone. How have they not been sued already? Right? This is super dangerous. Whoa, that was weird. My back felt all tingly for a sec. Ah! Wait. Where are you going? Wait. Okay, I could see me doing that. <laughs> Victory! Did that lady fall over at the 18th step? I think so. Then she ran away as fast as she could be... As fast? She, uh, then she ran away so fast she could be an Olympic sprinter. Weird. Didn't feel nothing. Me neither. Well, I guess this legend was fake. Hey, what happened back there? I, 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 I... Lord Rindo. Lord Rindo, Maya suggests trying to scan that woman. She seems incapable of explaining much herself at present. Okay, good idea, Nagi. Well, that was so scary. I've never been so terrified just slipping on the steps. I felt shiver go down my spine. Apparently, she felt a shiver run down her spine. Doesn't sound like she knows what caused it, though. There must be something we're all missing. 
I don't know, yo. Let's looks like a regular set of stairs to me. Think of it. Hey, you didn't actually fall over. You don't feel anything unless you hit the ground. So any takers? Let's gotta do it. How we fun-uh decide this? Rock, paper, scissors seems appropriate. Fine by me. Let's go. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Again? Ah, oh, Curses! Sorry, boss. This is her second time as well. Do not weep for me. I shall accept my fate with humility. Time to... Uh... Whoa, you went head first. You okay, Pinky? Yeah, you could try the softer approach, boss. You feel naggy. I... Oh, no, 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 no. What, you see something? Get away from there, Penny Hustle. I feel so cold all of a sudden. Let me try to scan the area. The hell? It's Scorpion. No, it's a noise. Let's show it what happens when you mess with the Wicked Twisters. Jordy loves reading. All I did was spamming X and Rage like Grandma. I was thinking of buying some today, but I think I'm gonna wait a bit. <laughs> Sounds like a good idea, Eco. You could save a bit of the cash as well, dude. Also, yeah, I I like the story of this game. I can't just skip it. Feels bad, especially if I make uh, YouTube videos of the streams. Guess you're hiding spunk goodbye, punk. It's go time. Magic hooker cards. <laughs> Magic hooker cards. Yep, yeah, normal. Gotta get my head back in the zone. Take a chance. Ooh, is that a new one? I guess noise just hanging out anywhere these days. Never before have I felt so chilled to the bone. It's abundantly clear to me how this became an urban legend. You think it stung you or something? Man, that must really hurt. Not only did you fall over, but you got a surprise sting in the boot. Like, I can't imagine things going any worse for you. And I need to be reminded of my suffering! Anyway, we've got all the info we need now. Let's report back to the Reaper. We got a new triangle, baby! Oh yeah, that's what it's all about, yeah! Something like that. Oh wait, I'm on triangle. God damn it in here, I thought I could level up a new one. With Freddy boy. Let's have a look. <sighs> yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. I guess I could go around or two. Go 
So far, so good. Level up! Follow me, yo! Leave it to me, yo. Move it, yo. Move it, yo. Sure, you already jump into the explosion. Almost level fifty. We've got this in the bag. Hey, no stop us now. Move it, yo. Oh man, that's it. Oh man, that's it. Breaking news: SQ likes chocolate. Right, could have been worse. It's not really breaking news. We already knew this. <laughs> Dogenza, West Terminal, two in Dogenza. Cool. Hello there. And hentai says he go. Tower Records. Let's have a look. Wonder if I'm supposed to go. Let's move. Back to the Reaper first. Let me think this through. Okay, now this area is uh, empty.
Dogen and Exit Terminal. Okay, let's go to those two areas first for the side quests. Hens and ties. Very sure this area got a legend of its own. Permit me to prowl the interrupts. Even the sites with nary traffic have been erased. Makes you wonder how the other teams are tackling this mission. You can say that again. Who cares about the other teams? Yo, we've got our own strengths. Let's use them. Come on, Fret, you're up. Okay, sit back, relax, and leave it to me. There goes nothing. Let's have a look. So what are we thinking here? Come on. I oh, got him. Try to remember. You think in the cesspool of degeneracy you will find someone who doesn't like hentai? Even completely understand what hentai is. <laughs> Look at that fucking coppa. That's the Jimbo Tron. I was That's the Jimbotron um, uh, Chestery mentioned, right? The one that shows some place for a split second, and if you go there, you die in seven days' time. Wait, what do you have to do there to die again? Thing... He said you have to walk around counterclockwise one time, like... Who would even do that? Man, look at the time. I've got to hurry. I want to to swing by 104 and Tower Records before I meet my friend for desserts at Shibuya Hikari. Um. Thinking of getting this game, how is it? The last BOA. It's a very good game. I'm addicted, and uh, the fact that I need to go to bed and do things during the day that isn't streaming makes me feel uh, not very good. <laughs> Man, when is that place gonna show on the big screen? Manchester said some place in Shibuya appears on the Jumbotron for one second every day. Guess urban legends are just that legends. Who cares if some place in Shibuya gets shown once a day anyway? Uh, I still have so much time till the concert starts. Wonder where I can hang out without spending any money. Miyashita Park, I guess? So we gotta find a place that flashes on the Jumbotron. Place where once one walks counterclockwise, one dies. Seven days later or so, they say. Even if that's true, who the heck would actually try it? I fear you are directing your question at the wrong person. <sighs> the place only shows up on screen for a second, right? Really not feeling just staring at the TV forever waiting to see it. Maybe there are some way we could find out roughly when it gets shown. I could try using my psych in front of the Jumbotron. Sounds like a plan. If you think it'll work, yo. It will, as long as I get the right idea. Right, time to focus on that big screen. 
What's the deal with that place that just flashed on the Gym Patrol for a sec? Like a building covered in plants. Screen must be on the fritz. Building covered in plants. Anyway, time to go check out some vintage clothing shops. Cat Street never disappoints. Uh, I swear I just saw something on the big screen. Looked like a building with an arc. Arch. Hang on, I'm back here again. Why is this crossing making life so hard for me? Man, I know I've seen that place that just showed up on the big screen. It's sandwiched between two streets, somewhere around here. My feet are always dead after walking around Shibuya. That's because of all the hills. Maybe I'll wear my cushion sneakers next time. Maybe. Sounds like there's plants growing on the walls of this plate. Glass. And it has an arch. And what's about between two roads? Tower Records. <clears throat> if anyone thinks they know where it might be, let me know, okay? I know where it is. We just came from uh, the location. So let's eat. Let's increase our stats. Twenty-five bonus stats. Nice. Bye now. Mode. Hmm. Well, there's plants on the walls there. And several arches, and it's between two roads, yo. Ah, the building on the screen must have been Modi. Mm -hmm. Nice teamwork. Nice work, team. Anyway, what were we supposed to do once we got here again? One must walk in a single counterclockwise circle. Oh, right. Wait, won't that kill me? Well, we ain't gonna know if nobody gives it a shot. It's cool, I'll do it. I mean, if you really wanna. It's all I to stop him now. He's already halfway around. Don't seem to have any apparent effect. Imagine if we had to actually wait the full seven days. Hold it. Hey, Twistery Nose. I've been watching you kids for a while now. So exactly what kind of business have you got with me? Let me guess, trying to rack up points? Wait. None of points got to do with any of this. I mean, if you're not interested, then I'll be on my way. Could you at least tell us what you're talking about? We're only here because we need to look into some urban legends, such as... They say as if, say if one walks around this area counterclockwise, one perishes within a week. You gotta get to the bottom of this stuff to get past one of your pals. So hurry up and tell us if you know something, yo. I've had enough of your attitude, punk. Time time for you to face the noise. <sighs> well, that escalated suddenly. <clears throat> I think we've got this. Move it, yo. Let's 
Keep it going. Nothing. Come on. Hang in. Keep your eyes on me. Heads up. Contribution. Great job. Leave it to me, yo. Leave to me, yo. Worse, you feel. Are we just getting. Why are we getting so many Uber pins all of a sudden? Damn it all! So you feel like talking now? How about you start telling us what you're doing here? <laughs> Don't make me kick you while you're down! Okay! I was using the Jumbathron to advertise my location, and if they walked kind of cross counterclockwise around the pillar, I knew they wanted to do business. My terms are simple. Shibu pay me 300,000 yen for one round with a noise. You mean they're providing players with? Yeah. You got it. Points. For all the sloths who take day off here and there, this is just my way of helping them keep with the rat race. Get their head in the game again, you will. Still, 300k seems kind of steep for one noise. Hey, the market dictates the prices, not me. I see. Tells me that these transactions are far from kosher. Take a chill pill, Specs. The rankings aren't gonna change because someone took out uh, an extra noise or two. Service I provide is for players who don't want their team leaders to know they have been slacking. Well, which teams are we talking about here? Canons, Motoys? <sighs> All I'm gonna say is there are a few players who aren't exactly playing, but they know they'd be in hot water if their leader found out. That's one way of putting it. And that's where I come in. But what's any of this got to do with the RG? What do you mean? Oh, those punks with a sixth sense. Yeah, a few people from the RG picked up my subliminal messaging, but they were getting in the way, so I sent them packing. So that's how this whole legend came to Seriously, be. Yo? Your joke, yo. I fear we may have rework to rework the truth when the report we report our findings this time. Probably a good idea if you don't want to earn the wraths of your rivals. Doubt they take kindly to being out of those cheats anyway. See ya. Peace. We can think about what to tell the Reaper on the way. The most important thing is we know the truth. Let's head over and give him the report. I don't want to give him the report yet. You know, I kind of thought Urban Legends would be a little more legendary. For real? There ain't no mystery, yo. The only mystery is how you managed to solve any of them. Whoa! Hey, loser. So what were you pinheads talking to uh, that other Reaper about? What Reaper? The one with pink hair, duh. Oh, you refer to Lady Uzuki. Right, right, so were you chatting about the game or something? Well, kinda, yeah. Turns out we might not be dead after all, which is actually a bad thing in this case. Aw, oh, bummer. Hey, kitty cat. You with the Shinjuku gang, right? Yeah, and? Only the Shinjuku Reapers is messed up enough to drag living people into Yu-Gi-Yo. So? What's it to you? Just want to know what your angle is. What do you all get out of doing this? Hell if I know. And even if I did, why would I bother telling you bozos? A Reaper. Listen, Reaper. It's Shoka. No, you're a Reaper from now on. As far as the RG is concerned, we don't exist right now. Can that ever be fixed? Not if you don't win. So why don't you stop moping and get on with the mission? 
You've seen how the Roombringer's been cleaning up every week, your point. How come y'all don't just go ahead and make him Reapers already? Ain't no point in having them play the game forever and ever. It's their choice. They say they want to keep playing, so we let them. I got another question for you. How come you Reapers is doing nothing when it's called the Reapers game, yo? Roombringers is acting more like the Reapers than any of y'all. Hmm, pretty bold statement from coming from a Reaper reject. You think you know so much about our job because you played some prehistoric version of the game? The only people who matter around here are the people with power. Weaklings can whine all they want, but nobody's gonna listen. Well then, why don't they quit whining and start acting? Because I can't, that's just how Shiba... I mean, that's just how we do things in Shinjuku. As long as you've got power, then the game is yours. Take no prisoners, leave no survivors. That's the Shinjuku way. That's brutal. Maybe, but if you really want to get ahead, then you gotta do whatever it takes. What kind of uh, whatever. I'm talking trickery, deceit, lies, backstabbing, whatever it takes. <laughs> the dirtier you play, the more fun it is to watch. So I hereby grant you permission to put on one hell of a show. You're rotten to the core, yo. Less a goddess of death and more agent of disorder. Aw, oh, you're too kind. Now, go out there and prove how wicked you really are, will ya? It's about time someone shook things up Is around here. Later, looter... looters? Later, losers! Well, if she really wants us to shake things up, taking on the room bringers would be a good start. I say we accept Conlon's offer. You would say that. What you thinking about taking on the Reapers? That proposition could place us in great peril. Pete, Nagi, what do you two think about teaming up with Conlon? It ain't a bad idea. I just don't know what much about the lady. If y'all think we can trust her, then I'm all in, yo. Admirable though Lady Conlon's display of chivalry may be. It is difficult to discern the authenticity of her intention. Yeah, that's what I thought. There's still so many unknowns. I don't know what... Great, it's everyone's favorite game master. Greetings, Greetings Sheeple of Shibuya! This is your game master, Shiba, speaking. Hope you're still hungering for more on day number four. Got some red hot news for you. Ain't this guy ever mixing things up? Cannot recall hearing any other variations. Target's still on the loose, completely unsighted. It is as if all of Shibuya has gone cold. Don't tell me you're all start to hibernating. Here's hoping it's just quiet before the firestorm. If not, then I don't see much of a future for this city. Guess this guy is a Shinjuku Reaper too. So awaken from your wintry slumber, players, lest the Roombringers win again. It's time to burn the candles of your imagination at both ends and show me what you're really made of. I trust this punk. What's the real point of this game, yo? Heh. And with that, I bid you adieu. I see. Shall we proceed with the mission then? Shall we ever? Assuming you were talking to me, that is. You learn well. Perhaps too well. Perhaps a little too well. Hey there, dude. I already Fight checked everything here. Let's move. I'm kind of surprised this place has its own legend. The only story I know concerning this area is from two generations ago. I'm most kind of curious to see how it may have evolved over time. Huh? I thought urban legends just kind of stayed the same. Not quite. Some stories change in nature as they age. So what is the deal with this place anyway? <laughs> well, you will die the second I tell you. Do you still wish to hear the details? I think I'm gonna pass. How about I'll look into a more recent legend instead? Good idea, yo. Okay, here goes. Focus for it.
try to remember. Remind. Doesn't really look like anyone remembered anything. Oh, there's a person. Two people. It's gone. Magistry said stepping on one of the white lines on the crossing in front of 104 gives you really bad luck. Gonna have to avoid all of these lines just to be safe. Oh no, I came to 104 to visit my favorite makeup store, but it's gone. That was the only one in all of Japan. We already have bad luck. See if there's anything new to buy for your team. No. Yeah, I'll come back now. Welcome. Welcome. This is the crossing in front of 104. I remember seeing some video about a guy who got into an accident and cursed the place. Huh? So that's the kind of Asori that goes with that jacket. Seeing what people wear in Shibuya gives me so many outfit ideas. So the crossing in front of 104 is cursed. One shall drown in despair if they step on a certain white line. Well, why don't we try starting by staking out the crossing? Alright, sounds good. Say, Rindude, what? You see those people suddenly stopping in their tracks? Uh -huh. Now that you mention it, it's kind of weird, right? So, you guys notice anything? A few people just stopped walking in the middle of the crossing, all at the exact same spot, too. And that's exactly what exactly did they do once they stopped. Looked at their phones, I guess, and then start walking again after mm. a second. Sounds pretty normal. Maybe it has was just one big coincidence. Wait. That girl stopped walking too. Fuel my wrath. I'll curse every last one of you. Looks like... Looks to me like she's just texting you. Get it if they were all taking pictures in the same spot or something? Wait. Hey Fred, doesn't that guy look a bit off to you? Which one? Hmm... Oh, that guy, yeah, he... I guess he's kinda close. Definitely, he does not believe in personal space. How can one so brazenly stare at another's phone? Truly, it's mind-boggling. Honestly, I'm more confused by how she has noticed him. Yeah, she looks pretty damn chill. You think they're friends or something? Hang on, I can't scan that guy. It's a player. So he's one of us. Let's start talking to him. Hey, you got a minute? How can you... Oh, I get it. You're a player. What's up, buddy? I was just wondering, are you one of the pure hearts? What gave it away? My arist aristocratic aura? Not really important, pal. We're much more interested in what you were doing just now. Oh, that? That was, uh, I mean, you know, I was just, uh, no, I don't need to explain myself to you. That Mr. Nice Guy act didn't last long, huh? Screw it! Enough talking, let's fight! Whoa, slow down a sec! Nah, let's rumble. One against four, guys. I can do this. Oh, this is gonna be easy! Or four against four, kind of depends on how you look at it. <laughs> Follow me, bro.
Take a look at me. Smashing, dashing, all the way to prison. Not too shabby. Another. <sighs> huh. <laughs> Can you tell when somebody's kidding? I was obviously kidding. I didn't actually want to fight you. Seriously, no reason to trash me like that. In that case, tell us. What were you doing just now? <sighs> I was just imprinting some words in her head. What's it to you? Is this guy for real? It's most rare to witness you so vexed. And what exactly was you trying to make her do anyway? I mean, you saw her, didn't you? It's making her text her friends. Helping her push the reset button on all her relationships. What? You know, everyone's so worried about their relationship and how people view them. I was just freeing her from that burden. You know, gave her a helping hand. You say? How about I help you shove your hand where the sun don't shine, yo? Yikes! Can someone put that dog on a leash already? <laughs> you're the mon, you're the mon. He always sings because he is your the mon. Is he a Pokemon? Nope, nope, nope. He's a Digimon. <laughs> God damn it. Well, But why? What do you get out of messing with some girl? The same pleasure you get from any act of charity? Charity? This guy got more than one screw loose. Don't like it? Well, tough. You kids can't control me. No one's running this- no one running this game cares how we use our powers either. That might be true, but you're still- Do not allow this cur to rile you up. You may be correct in stating that there are no restrictions on how we use our powers. However, that does not give you free reign to destroy innocent people's relationships. Kind of like what another used to say, no one has the right to do wrong. I suppose I cannot disagree. Well, Toy doesn't know you're doing this, does he? Huh? What does not matter? How do you think your leader would react if he found out about this? Is that a threat? You think I'll settle down and be a good boy the second you mention the boss? You think I'm the one with the screw loose? By all means, if he's fine with this type of behavior, then allow me to set you straight. What you're doing is wrong. You know, I was honestly just messing around. Oh, really? Yep. But I apologize if I upset you. You won't catch me doing this again anyway. See him. Don't beat a dog. I thought he's a horny mom. Yeah, he did call Be the Dog. It's a rather expeditious retreat. You really never know what kind of person you're gonna bump into next. It must be hard enough to just keep your teammates under control. And working with other teams into the mix and things get really hectic. I well, guess that takes care of that. Let's go tell the Reaper about it. sure thing. Hey. Hola there, Senor Rindo. Votoy! Fancy running into Vouse here. By which I mean you, sorry. Cosmopolitician habits die hard. So anyway, today's Michonne is really doozy, huh? All the spooky supernatural stuff kinda gives me the creeps. No kidding, I'd have thought it was right up your alley. Might be more at ease if I could see behind the curtain, so to speak. Their new face, huh? Meet Lord Motoy, the leader of the Pure Hearts. So you ain't with us then. Sacre bleu. You must be the infamous Mr. Daiskino. Can it? I go by beat, yo. Ah, miscusi, my dear beat. They say you are 
Should there be an inform, uh, I mean, muy culto about how the Reapers operate? Michael, like, oh, what'd you say? <clears throat> Looks like it's Spanish for knowledgeable. Just say so, yo. My sincerest apologies. Good for you, though, Rindo. Kana and I would kill to have a player like being on our side. <laughs> Is that so? Of course, there are only a few teams left, so we need what help we can get if we want to avoid erasure. Yeah, I know the feeling. What predicament. We are truly less miserables. It's times like these that people usually go for a... What's it called? Ah, uh, yes, an alliance, uh, an alliance. I'm sure that's would put us at ease. It'd be more at ease if I knew what that was. Italian for alliance, apparently. What exactly do you mean by that? Ah, uh, forgive me, I didn't intend to present it uh, as an outright proposal. Well, it wouldn't be the first we've heard it. Has someone else already approached you? Uh, yeah. Struggle to imagine those thugs in the first place asking for assistance, which only leaves Canon. Right? Maybe we should just tell him. No, that's an awful idea. Hey, no need to fret at all. Fret. <laughs> to fret at all. Fret et al. I had a suspicion Kanon might be plotting something like this again. Again? She wants you to help her bring Rune to the Runebringers, right? I thought she might have given up after her first attempt. A few attempts failed. But I guess she changed her tune after witnessing your potential. When did she fail before? Well, let's see. There was that fight against the sturdy Tsukichi and then about with the silent but deadly Tsugumi. But you lot managed to shut them both down. No mean feats, let me tell you. Fascinating. So the Runebringer's leader is remaining in until their underlings have been bested. And I must really believe in us. I don't envy your position, mi amigos. You faced with a tough decision. Hmm. But allow me to share my thoughts. Forming an alliance under the current circumstances would be more bien. Do you think it's a good idea? It certainly isn't a bad one, and I'm prepared to do what I must as well. What's that? Why well, help out, of course. The more people working together, the better the results. Hey. Uh, the verite of the matter is, I don't want to get erased, and if possible, I don't want anyone else to get erased either. Right there with you, Motoy. It says I once wrote, existing means being here or wherever you may be. I think it's vital we don't lose sight of the undeniable fact that all of us exist here right now together. Yeah, I think I get what you mean, like we're here for a reason. Dig it, yo. Even if you ain't here now, you was before, and that still matters. Certainly nice to be... Uh, I can't pronounce that word, it's like I don't even understand. Talking to Motoy is probably the worst for me, because I no idea sometimes what he's saying. I'm eternally grateful to the city that brought us together and to all those who call her home. Let's give it our all, eh, amigo? Drop me a line whenever you feel like it. Until then, au revoir. Au revoir. Man, I feel bad for Moto, you know? Stuck in a place, in last place and everything. Alright, the room bringers are on top and we're right behind them. And that leaves either Moto or Kanon's team in the bottom. <sighs> oh. Let me think this through. One oh four. Scramble crossing, cat street. Oh east. And Shibuya Hikari. Let's go do the side quest first in Was there anything new here? No, right? Well, howdy. Come back oh, we now. explored everything. Doganzaka! Let's have a look! Okay, um... 
change you to... I think we're going with the winds because it's pretty strong. That's Gato Nero. The hell are you talking about? Uh, that's guy, that guy's hoodie. You saw someone wearing the other day, right? Wait, is that the same guy? Uh -huh. It appears the poor fellow has been possessed. Now that you mention it, he is giving off a pretty funky aura. Alas, we may have no choice but to go on the offensive. You said it, yo. Let's do some of them extinctions. Yes. Close enough. Anyway, let's do this. Let's hope it's not too bad of a uh, level 38. <laughs> Recommend level 33. Let's see what kind of enemies. Shouldn't be too hard. Uh, let's take it back. Frogs. Healthy erasure. Oh, okay. Heals me. Good to know. It makes me feel like we're not going to be able to finish this in three waves, are we? We'll see. Push over like me. Oh, this sucks. Noise erased. Is that it? Nice. Gold! <sighs> Yay! Points that we can spend. I came all the way from Kansai to buy some Gato Nero for my kid sister, but that cashier was so cute. I bought a ton of stuff just to see her smile. Hope I can still afford rent. Well, it was fun while it lasted, but it's time to move on. Still st stuck with all these Mr. Meow dolls, so sister's getting more presents than she bargained for. I, I respect the brother that loves his little sis. I team Lesbos. 
Nice work, Nagi. Whew. Thoughts. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Where? Where is? Where? Tokyo hands buy three items. I don't remember where that is. Rent synergy. Oh well. Yeah, there should be another one nearby. Hey, Rin, dude, you hungry? Me? Uh, I'm you know, really. Honestly, neither am I. But I got this sun carving for curry. And once the carving hits, I just gotta have somewhere else. That's the part where you get scared. Oh no, I'm so scared. Yeah, with Fred, I could go for a nice bowl curry. See, Rin, dude, beat gets me in the way you never will. Stop being dramatic. Wanna just go to the dons? Yes, I knew you'd come around. Hold up, ain't this a ramen joint? Used to be, but now they do curry. Man, I'm starving, oh no. The place is packed to the max. Glad to see business booming at least. The Don sure looks busy. Not just busy, but overwhelmed, and understandably so. Uh, come on, let's line up so with everyone else. Chicken in this curry is positively exquisite, marinated to perfection. Do I detect the richness of expertly tempered chumin? Not to mention the base. The depth is reminiscent of a hearty ramen broth. Oh, and these finishing spices. It's an entirely new culinary experience. Damn, I feel all sophisticated just listening to that. Oh, that's Buddy Rapids from Shibuya Historical Society. Fascinating. Far be it from him to miss the opening of a remarkable new shop in Shibuya. Didn't think he'd be into... Didn't think he'd be this into curry, though. Actually, There's just one thing amiss. Huh? Disgraceful. Don't you know who I am? Enough, I'm leaving. Oh, uh, thanks. Come again. How utterly infuriating. What? What's up with him? Something must have followed his mouth. Mouth? Mood. Maybe the curry was bad? Doubt it. He wiped the whole plate clean. Ah, dang it. I completely forgot to give him a glass of water. It's gotten into me. You don't think, is that what Buddy was pissed about? All over a glass of water? Seriously, it's not that big a deal. Mistakes happen all the time. Especially when you're busy as the Dawn is right now. Perhaps he interpreted the absence of water as an affront to his personage. Ow, it's just water! It's prestige comes pride, and pride is easily wounded. I expect he may spread words of today's perceived subpar experience, painting himself as the victim of poor service naturally. The Dawn doesn't deserve that. It was just a mistake. Gotta sort this out. He can't gone far, yo. We can still catch him. Yeah, let's follow after him. Let's have a look. <laughs> Found him over there. Yep. Spicy curry done, eh? You'll rue the day you left me parched without refreshment. What's he doing? Is he gonna call someone or leave a bad review? I know, but it looks like we were right about what made him angry. We have to stop him. He can't let him smear his shit all over the net. Agreed, we should resolve this misunderstanding quickly. Imprinting may be our best bet. Alright, let's do this. Gotta focus. <coughs> it's the worst service I've ever, ha ever received. They didn't even give me a glass of water. Their future looks bleak. Brand new, the Dawn. Let's try that.
brand new dawn. The shop may look fresh, but it can't say the same for its owner. It can switch up the menu or even redo the entire interior. It still won't erase those crow feet. crow's feet. Well, that didn't work. Gotta pick some better words, I guess. Tasty the dawn. Probably doesn't work either, but who cares. Don't give a rat's fanny what the dawn tastes like. I'm here for his dishes. A joke of a restaurant won't be receiving any good reviews from me, that's for sure. Okay, let's try brand new curry. Sauce was incredibly rich and flavored. I can honestly say I've never tasted anything like it in my life. Was no scrumptious. I cleaned my entire plate. I'll definitely be back for more. Actually, a curry, though. It's extraordinary. Eating it was like entering into an uncharted world of culinary delight. Right. Must inform all my fellow curry enthusiasts. Fixed it. <laughs> Phew, Christ, subverted. Thank goodness for that. Still. Guy's got a real stick up his ass. Getting all heated over some lousy water. May seem trivial, but from his perspective, his most basic expectations were not met. It may have made him feel unwelcomed. Or as if he were being deliberately provoked. None of this is true, of course. It was a mere mistake. But that doesn't change how he felt about it, and those feelings negatively impacted his overall experience. Everything else could be perfect, but just one mistake. And suddenly, the entire meal is ruined. The human mind is a volatile, is a volatile and fickle thing. You think? <laughs> I still don't make sense to me. Yeah, you don't seem like the type to let uh, slit up get in the way of good meal. Of course not. Nothing could keep me from enjoying my food. Someone put a lot of time and effort into making it. No way I'm, <clears throat> no way I'm dissing the love they put in it. Well, beats. That's really sweet, actually. So, are we okay with not eating any curry? No way. Let's head back. Hopefully, it's not sold out. No, sold out. Too bad. So I, it's okay, Tummy. Maybe next time. Bummer, yo. Guess we'll just have to try again tomorrow. Uh -huh. Ark, could that be the prince? Mm. Oh, brother. If he is here, then the place will be crawling with his followers tomorrow. But, 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 my curry, leave some for me. Reminds me of that guy from Deep River Society we met here. Hope he managed to get a bowl for himself. Oh yeah, they got, like, ass-kicked. Buddy Rapids. I need a break. Busy. Okay. Here is our Buddy Reverse. Increased frequency with rare noises. Symbols will appear. Mm. Oh. Can't say I mind. Okay, time to head to O East. Sutaya! So, what's the story with this place? Well, we won't know until we scan the area. Come on, Fred, time to cut loose, yo. Alrighty. Focus, Fred. Focus. Remind! Something smells. You're right, you do, lady. 
I feel like this place was in one of Machistri's videos, right? Something about getting in an accident if you throw your trash in the wrong can. Never do that, so there's nothing for me to worry about. Still, something about this spot really stinks. It must be something from the trash cans over there. Ugh, could have picked a better place to meet my date. Go check the, the stores, see if there's anything new. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. Nope. Hello, welcome. So soon? What a shame. Gotta focus. Did I just see a red crow? <laughs> no way. This can't be one of the Magistrate's urban legends. Wait, there was one about getting cursed by a red raven if you throw your garbage in the wrong trash can, right? Not that it matters, I didn't see anything after all. Seriously, nothing at all. In fact, I've forgotten everything that happened today. Nope, definitely not cursed. Anyone who throws their garbage in the wrong trash can gets cursed. And stalked by red ravens. Such noble protectors of our environment. I don't know, boss. I don't think anyone deserves to get caught in an accident. Whatever, let's go check out the garbage. Good idea. Digging through the garbage like a real man. Mm -hmm. So, that's a trash can of terror. Noted as for combustible garbage only. You see that? Oh yes, that impudent cur. Looks like he threw away a bottle or a can. And it's time to take out the tra- Whoa, whoa, beat, buddy, calm down a sec. Oh, well. There it is, the Red Raven. Landed right on that guy's head, but it doesn't look like he noticed. That's just a punk-ass noise, yo. What a buzzkill, I wonder. Based on what we've learned of this curse, I doubt it is merely a punk-ass noise. Oh yeah, someone said how it gets people into accidents, right? Let's uh, just follow the guy for now. Follow the leader, 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 follow the leader. Uh -huh. There's a guy, whoa, he's walking straight into traffic. He appears rather determined to pick up the litter on the road. You think that noise is controlling him? Maybe, Nagi, can you, uh, you think he can exercise that noise? Would be my pleasure, pardon the intrusion. Let's have a look. Shiny treasure, I've got to pick up that treasure before someone else steals it. Whoa, look, there's more shiny treasure over there. Shiny treasure! Rah! Ready! Holy shit, that's a big bear. Jesus, that took me one minute and a half. Okay, 
We got this. <clears throat> Rhino. Silver, Scheiße. This might have been the last one. Yeah. Well. Sad. But I guess some is better than none. Whoa, where the hell am I? And why do I feel like I need to pick up anything shiny? Whoa, what am I doing here? Hang on, wasn't I outside in... Oh, east? Weird. Phew. Who going, Penny? Yeah, for real. Was looking dicey for a second there, but you pulled it off, boss. So it really was just uh, some dumb old noise, huh? Looks like it. I guess it was nesting near those trash cans. Must have had a real thing for cans, you know, thing since they're shiny and everything. And probably didn't care about the burnable garbage, since most of it, you know, is not shiny. Indeed. Imagine your hypothesis is more or less correct. Raven seemed to be quite fond of shiny mm. objects. Case closed, then? Guess so. At least we know why it turned into a story about people mixing up trash cans now. Yep, like Fred said, case closed. So, we go, we good to tell everyone's favorite Reaper about our adventure? I think so. Let's move. Is path here? Yeah, good. West exit bus terminal. Food! Hello. Style, attack, and defense. And now Man, I am starving! Man, I'm starving! Thanks for coming. Come in, come in! Thanks a bunch. Hurry back. Let's move. Hey there. We meet again, Wicked Twisters. What? Oh, what? you. Don't tell me you forgot about me already. It's. I'm Sumoi from the Pure Hearts. Remember from me from yesterday? Oh. Nah. Seriously? Oh, I remember you, alright. Yeah. You tried to do us in, you cheater. Oh, that. So sorry. It won't happen again. What do you want? Nothing big, really. I was just hoping for some advice. What kind of advice? Motoi messaged the team, but I can't quite figure out how to respond. It's easy. Just tap the empty bar, start typing it. <laughs> I know that. What I mean is Motoi is always using all those fancy foreign words. It's hard to follow. Ah, uh, yes. By the time I think I've got a handle on it, he spouts off some more gibberish. Dude, I know exactly what you mean. 
I know he expects us all to keep up with him, but I'm having a hell of a time matching his pace. Why not just tell him that straight up? Yeah, no, this isn't middle school. Stuff like that doesn't fly in proper society. Real adults have to walk in step with their superiors, not the other way around. Super basic stuff. I not go ask some real adults for advice then? I would, but for some reason Motoy's taken a liking to you a lot. Really? Yep, he says some real nice things about you, so I thought you might be able to help me find the right words. So he talks about us, about me. Sure does, so what do you say? Can you spare a few wise words to say to Motoy? So you ask so nicely. This debate is taken. Uh, let's just get this over with, yo. All we gotta do is send the brother a reply, yeah? Right, but we gotta do it all adult-like. So, what does this message say? It says, uh, here. It'll be easier if you read it yourself. Let's see. <clears throat> when it comes down to it, we're all compadres in this game, capiche? So, I thought we could have a little remuniges. I mean, portre, right? But enough about me. I'd love some comments from everyone. <sighs> Not a single person has responded. Whoa. I'm pretty sure he just wants to know how we feel about joining forces with other teams. Sound about right. Hell if I know. Let's assume he sends a lot of messages like this. I feel like everyone sets a new standard for illability Ill illegible and even if you understand it how the heck are you supposed to respond you know can't just leave him on red i'll make all of us including moto look bad are you up for the task don't know but i'll give it a shot i gonna search someone on my own just have to think like another what would he say in this situation Play is always the best option, right? Maybe something like... Hmm? Respond, whoa, he seems happy, really. <laughs> like your mudos operandi was spot on. Phew, that's my job done for the day, see you around. What a weirdo. What's his deal anyway? Ah, eh, who cares? We did him a favor and he got out of our hair. Now let's get moving. Oh, I might well use all those foreign words now. If you're kind of smart. Really? You feel kind of smart. Don't know what to say about that. In all honesty. Noise magnet, hold R2 while scanning to draw in nearby, no nearby noise. That's nice. Yo, you've been in here. Look who's here, see you around. Yeah, let's see, what do we still need to complete? Mystery of Shibuya Hikari, Cat Street. It's the only two left. This place is supposed to have its own legend too. Shibuya sure ain't short on them. So, you gonna do your thing or what, Fred? Oh, right, I totally forgot that. Uh, here goes. Gotta focus. So, what are we thinking here? Trust 
Try to remember. Try to remember. He's getting sleepy. It's not like I've done a lot today. I love legends. Pretty sure that overpass is the one a massa much as three featured in one of his urban legend videos the one writes by Shibuya Hikari I'll have to go check it later uh, someone discovered a new urban legend something about a maniac flower uh, I love how Shibuya always gives birth always giving birth to new stories our neighbor up north in Ikebukuro all to tune it up a to the supernatural like us. Eerie arrows. I wonder if that's the graffiti uh, Machistre was talking about. He said anyone who follows those arrows disappears, right? Seems kind of sketchy to me. <clears throat> Looks like there's some kind of story uh, connected to the overpass by Hikari. Uh -huh. And I suspect that is where the cursed arrows lie in wait. I ain't scared or nothing, but that's gotta be bogus, right? I suppose there is but one way to find out. You said it, let's head to the overpass. Yeah, while we go to the overpass, Yordi is actually first going to go see if there's anything to buy here. Greetings. Thank you kindly. Ada 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 ada. There's our arrows. <sighs> Doesn't look like anything to me. What? This ain't even close to being spooky. Hmm. Actually, now that I think about it, I have seen this somewhere before. Man, where was it? I see. Lord Rendo, where would you say these arrows are pointing? Looks like the express Good underpass. Job. Then LeBounce and check it out! I also did all the runes. You're told to do a few, but I don't read. Gaming takes all your energy, yo. Truth. It's part of the gig. Check it out, yo! Curious. It certainly bears an uncanny resemblance to those arrows we just gazed upon. Uh... <clears throat> but they're all pointing in different directions. What that about? Sure, makes it tough to know where to Lord go. Rindo. Lord Rindo, may I? You suppose the code at the bottom right it has some sort of significance. It might. Let me try scanning it with my phone. What? Some kind of clue, yo? Seek the fortress that houses those who protect this area. Follow the arrow that points left when viewed from the fortress gate. That's a bit about people who protect this area would mean about a million different things. But you ought to begin by searching for this so-called fortress. God beat says yo too much. I mean, the dentist is kind of like a fortress that protects people's teeth, right? Mm, don't most people only go after they've got problems? Got a problem? One could say those who go for their regular checkups are being protected. Oh, right. See, boss gets me. Let's go ahead and add it to the list. Man, I don't know. A fortress that protects the area? Does this place really fit? Anyone else kind of uneasy? What, you th you did something we should know about? No, I'm a good boy, okay? And act like it, yo, otherwise the pigs start sniffing around. Wait, what am I worried for? They can't even see us. 
Personally speaking, I feel most at ease when police officers are nearby. Shibuya is full of... Full of all sorts of shady characters, after all. One never knows what might await when turning a corner. I imagine I am far from the only one who feels safer with people in uniform around. Either way, a police station does fit the description in that clue pretty nicely. <coughs> Oh no, anything but a dentist. No worries, SQ. You are finally done with going to the dentist for half a year, at least. What about Ryoji's store? That's not exactly the first place that comes to mind when I think of somewhere. Uh, keep Shibuya safe. Frankly speaking, I would describe its owner a harbor as a harbinger of chaos. What did he do to get such bad rap stuff? Still, I guess you could consider him a protector of the peace, depending on your perspective. Let's keep him in mind. Feels like we've checked out all the places, most likely. I suggest we consider them all, while consulting the map. That's great, Nagi. I suppose it's advantageous to have me around sometimes. Nice going, boss. Okay, this is a good chance to review everything we've learned so far. So which one of these arrows do you, you need to follow? The clue was seek the fortress that houses those who protect this area. Then when you are at the fortress, you have to follow the arrow that's pointing left. I guess the so candidates for the fortress are Roji's store, police station, and dentist. If it's Roji's place, then we need to follow the yellow arrow. Whereas the police station, we want to follow blue. The dentist is pink. Have you reached the decision? I'd say let's go with blue. Yeah, pretty sure we want to follow the blue arrow. How come? No matter how you think about it, the fortress that protects the area has to be the police station. If you look at the arrows from its entrance, the blue arrow points its left. Man, you lost me. What you do you think? I am firmly in Lord Rindo's camp, which means I am too. Never go against the boss. I. Then that means we gotta head to the west exit bus terminal. Got it. Le bounce. Looks like that's the end of the arrows, which would suggest this is the spot where people are prone to vanish. Bus terminal? I mean, plenty of people get lost here, but that's kind of different. Wait, where did Rindu go? No idea, but he sure as hell ain't here. Oh my, he appears to have boarded yonder bus. Quit playing games, Rindu. Hurry up and get off the bus! How the fuck did he get on the bus? Phew, that was too close. Who knows where that would have taken me. Why'd you hop in on the first place, yo? Wish I could tell you, Beat. Hang on a sec, you're a player? Reaper, what are you doing here? Wait, you are the one to make me get on that bus, aren't you? My bad, my bad. I had my eyes on some saps from the RG. The one who shows up after following those arrows gets a free ride on whatever bus is about to leave. Honestly, I don't even know where they are headed half the time. Funny stuff, right? Tell me what exactly is your angle here. What's it to you, brat? I don't need to waste my time explaining myself to you. Anyway, there's no point putting players on buses. It's not like you get very far. I'm getting seriously ticked off just listening to you run your dumb mouth, yo. But at least we know who's behind that urban legend. Wait, you mean someone's already onto me? Crap! Actually, maybe this can work out. I just need you kids to do me a favor and die. No can do. Perfecto. You're done here. 
Lord Rindu. Could have been worse. I'm sorry it won't happen again. I just want to have some fun. Whatever you do, please don't tell the other Reapers. The other Reapers I see look crazy busy. Don't you have something else you should be doing? Honestly, I don't. There are so few teams now, I basically have no purpose. So I figured it wouldn't hurt if I pulled some pranks on peeps in the RG. I've got a funny idea of what qualifies as a prank. Come on, don't be such stiff. They get on some random bus, and then when they come to, they've got no idea where they are. You should see the looks of terror on the tourists' faces. Are you kidding me? He was just doing it because you were sad? Please don't hurt me, I just want someone to notice me. Aw. Notice me, senpai, notice me! Did you ever once consider how those people's friends felt when they vanished? Even if they ultimately came back safe and sound, the damage can't be undone. It's a little surprise this reoccurring phenomenon became the talk of the town. Hench are urban legends. I think this means we've got all the info we need now. Say, so I've been wondering, are you kids looking into this stuff for a mission? Well, yeah, in fact, we've got to go and tell the Reaper about this once sometime soon. Don't suppose I could convince you to keep What's quiet. This? How about you keep quiet? B -b of course, I'll just be on my way then, see ya. Split second, I swear I saw an actual tail between his legs. A punk better enjoy his freedom while he can. The Reapers will be over and soon enough, yo. <laughs> and that's a wrap. Indeed, this legend holds no more mysteries. Good work, team. Let's update the Reaper. Okay, there's one more place left to go. And it's cat time. Next area. Ugh. Time to cross off the last drink that was requested.
Whew, I have a feeling that tonight I'm gonna be sleeping like a teddy bear. Ain't there supposed to be a legend around here, yo? Yep. Think so. Want me to work my magic? By all means, time to focus on Machistry's urban legends. You, you were the last one that requested a chocolate milk. So here I am. Waste of a trip. Wasn't there a telephone pole from Magistry's Urban Legend over here on Cat Strain? Said you're supposed to be able to hear the voices of the dead if you get close enough. Ugh, figures they'd be sold out of that t-shirt after I came all this way. Just my luck. Why don't they have an online store? Hey. Guess the telephone pole is the one over our jupes. Whew. Probably. Now we just need to get a clo little closer and see if we can hear anything. Listening to the wails of the dead was not my to-do list. Not on my to-do list today. But let's hurry up and check it out, yo. You volunteering to listen, beat? For sure, my hero. <clears throat> Is it's called Cat Street and it has no cat? <laughs> Is there uh, the spot right? Can't hear a damn thing. Kudos to you for just going to check it out, Duff though. Anyway, maybe it takes a little while to get it going. Maybe. Let's wait and see if anything changes. That's weird. I could not agree more. What you mean? Can you see that lady who just walked by beat? They look spooked. Seriously? So legend was legit after all? Let's give him a scan and find out why. Gotta, focus. Gotta say, I love this area. You'd never know you're still in Shibuya. So much quieter over here than it'd be by the station. Was the person groaning just now, right? It sounded like they were hurt. Pretty sure it came from somewhere in front of me, but where? Whoa, that lady got so scared, she practically scared me half to death. Totally scareception. Time to investigate. Looks like something just spooked that lady over there. Real good. Maybe I'll go check it out myself. Too damn quiet. <clears throat> this place is way too quiet for a street that connects Shibuya and Harujuku. All this silence makes me want to go clubbing and make some noise. Yuck! Ooh, I'm pretty sure some weirdo behind me was just moaning to himself. Why am I such a creep magnet? I could have sworn I just heard someone groaning to my left. There's no one there. Sure seems like they heard something. Doubtless the souls of the damned. But how can only some people... Uh, how come only some people can hear it? No idea, that's part still a mystery. You think some people just have a sixth sense for stuff, that stuff? Let us ascertain what all those who can hear the voice have in common. Don't tell me you can't hear my voice now. Some of them ain't even standing here, though. Wait a second. The people who did hear the voices are standing in a straight, in a straight line. I guess so. But was it me? Perhaps we will find out if we follow the people's path. Our answer could lie along the line they create. Alright, let's head down the street. Doesn't look like there's anyone past here who's heard the voices. Right, let's have a look around here then. 
Whoa! Oh my! Damn, you guys scared me. What's up? You mean didn't you hear that? Uh, nope. How about you, beat? Ain't hear nothing, yo. Well, I certainly did. It was m most disturbing groan. No kidding. You think I'll hear too if I stand over there? Yeah, the hell was that? So you can only hear it if you're standing right here. Mystery deepens. Hey, I found it. That appeared to be a speaker. So what? It was just some dumb prank? Uh -huh. Oh dear, I can hear it again. Wait, it just stopped. Uh, boss? Appears one must stand between the speaker and the telephone pole to hear the sound. No way, you're right. It, it this is getting whack, <clears throat> getting whacker by the minute, yo. Let's see, speaker direction. Ah, this must be it. Apparently, it's called a directional speaker. What's it do? It lets you project sound in a specific direction, and if you don't stand in the right spot, you won't be able to hear anything. It certainly matches what we've experienced today. Yet, why is it here to begin with? <sighs> it's a bogus prank, yo! Look, there's a camera right there! I think someone's streaming footage of people freaking out. Oh, what a creep. But... I don't know that word. Some reprobate idea of a joke transformed into an urban legend. Guess they want to get famous by starting something supernatural. All that matters is we know what we... What's up now? Let's go tell that Reaper Great Minds. Yay! We're done! I doubt I needed to complete all of them. But who cares? Completing all of them, I get all the goodies. So you kids got any tasty morsels of information? Sure, do you want to hear a story about Shibuya Hikari? Boy, do I ever. There's this story about these cursed arrows. Real spooky, they say anyone who goes where they point yeah. disappear. Sure, sure, I know that one. So what actually happening? Some reaper led anyone who followed the arrows onto a random bus. Apparently he got a kick out of watching people panic beats me. <sighs> huh, well not all reapers are as calm and collected as yours truly. But like, shouldn't you tell them to cut that out? Not like they'd listen to any of us. Hmm. I guess you make a good point. Hang on. That's not important right now. It's time for me to pass judgment on your truth. I believe you. Your findings more or less match up with what I know. Phew. Which means you've just earned yourself 35 points. Yeah. More morsels. You want to hear a story about Oise? You bet. Lay it on me. This legend concerns a trash can most terrifying. Word has it that anyone who throws an unrecyclable into set can meet with an unfortunate fate. The Red Raven stalks the preparator uh, until they get in an accident. Right, right. One of my favorites. So what's the scoop? The Red Raven was actually a no noise. And it possessed anyone it saw throw shiny cans or bottles in the trash. Sounds like it wanted to get them to gather up even more shiny stuff. Possessed people got sent to search for shiny objects on the street, which unsurprisingly is when they get intimately acquainted with moving traffic. Alright, it's time for me to pass judgment on your truth. Great. Believe you, your findings more or less match up with what I know. Great. Which means you've just earned yourself 32 points. Oh. So you kids got any tasty morsels yes. for me? Sure, do you want to hear a story about Cat yeah. Street? Oh, this one's my fav that's one of my favorite spots. Okay, what do you got? Legend involves ghostly voices that whisper to one from the abyss. 
They say that if you step on the shadow cast by a certain pole, certain telephone pole, you can hear the voice of the dead. Ah, I love it. And what was the deal with this legend? It was actually just a prank someone was playing using a directional speaker. But really now, it's time for me to pass judgment on your truth. I believe you, however. What do you mean, however? It's a real bummer to find out it was just some dumb prank. Some urban legends are better left shrouded in mystery, I guess. Hey, you're the one who told us to get to the bottom of these. Undone by my own hubris. Anyway, you've just earned yourself 25 points. Nice teamwork. Yeah. Congrats, you finally managed to rack up 100 points. Stand in your way in any more noble seekers of truth. Phew. Starting to think we'd never get enough points. Hey. Have you any other teams completed your missions today? Hmm, good question. Honestly, my memory is a little hazy right now. Why don't you go see for yourself? It's no fun if I spoil the truth for you now, is it? Real talk. I'm fine with spoilers. Whatever, let's just go. Oh, and if you get to the bottom of any other urban legends, feel free to let me know. Jealous Rage! Hey! Sure, do you want to hear the story about the Scramble Crossing? Oh man, that one I'm super curious about. What did you find out? Uh, it's there's some shady deals going on, yo. There's buildings with flash on the big screen in the crossing. Anyone who goes there and walks around counterclockwise dies in seven days. Doesn't surprise me that one I've been making the rounds. So what was actually happening? So Sketchy Reaper was running a shady side hustle with players. Here, tell me more. Really? Well, about that. Uh, you're not gonna trick us and say we're wrong once we spill the beans. Nah, man, I'm not like that. I just want to know the truth, especially if it concerns one of my colleagues. Mm. How can we be certain you two are not merely using us? Having us players do your own internal investigations would be awful convenient. <laughs> Come on, you really think I'd stoop that low? I promise, I'm not playing you. Now hurry and share, fine. The deals were for turf war points. Mm, I knew that son of a... In nice work! That's super interesting. That's time yeah. to... I believe you. You actually found out way more than I did. In that case, you ought to sweeten the deal. How about giving us a few extra points? Oh, don't worry, kid. I will. I'm gonna give you whooping 40 for that one. Woohoo! Alright. Oh. So, you kids got any tasty morals left? You want to hear the story about Spain Hill? Sure do, come on, spill the beans. So there's the stairway, stairway to hell. They say the second your foot touches the 18th step, you get spirited away. Hard to believe, I know. Nah, I've heard that one plenty of times, so tell me, what's the deal with this legend? There was some scorpion-looking noise hiding out inside that stair. Anyone who walked over it tripped and suddenly got the chills. That's weird, it must have stung him or something. Regardless, the foul fiend starts to induce considerable panic, and that's putting it lightly. No wonder it's got people talking. All right, good job. Great. Believe you. You know, you kids might have a future in this line of work. Thirty points. Huh. Yes. You want to hear a story about 104? Ah, I was hoping you'd look into that one. Lay it on me. It's all about a white line that gives off some real bad vibes, yo. Just one line on the crossing outside of 104. Apparently, if you step on that sucker, you'll, you're all out of luck. So they say, well, what did you find out? Some player was messing with people by imprinting words in their heads. No kidding, who was it then? Come on, you can trust me. Not sure about that. And here, I thought we were best buds. <laughs> Sorry. I do hope that won't adversely impact the points we receive. Nah, no worries there. I just want to know everything I can. We told you the important stuff. Man, you really aren't going to give it up, are you? Alright, fine. It's time for me to pass judgment. I believe you. Everything you said matched up with what I know. Lived with myself, Motoy's team lost points because of me. Earned 28 points. <laughs> Not bad. No way, you kids have gotten to the bottom of every dang legend Shibuya has. Huh. Now that you mention it, I guess we have. You've m you're most legendary legend hunters I've ever met. Must hold back my tears. Alright, I've pulled myself together. Enough to give you a token of my thanks. Here, take this. 
You've earned it, you beautiful players. Our thanks that we earn. Hmm. Let me think this through. Pointless. Okay, so we got a new L1, I think, right? This one, Kinesis. Cool. Let's go. Dipsy toes all. Let's have a look. So you don't think that's our target? But then what's that over there? Whatever it is, the other team's already on it, yo. Oh, timely tidings. Our beauties engaged with their targets. Does that mean we each got our own to take care of? Guess which means that if we want to win today, we must slay our target before the others can claim kill theirs. Right, let's go. As long as we don't have to deal with any farts and smartsons. Kill it, end it. <clears throat> Noise erased. That's not so bad, right? Weak, you already weak. Balloon trip, that's a new R1. Jeez, that took, took forever. forever. What about the target, yo? Somebody beat us to it? It would appear so. The Varia Beauties took down today's target. Good for her, I guess. But the Ruin Bringers remain on top. <sighs> Same story, different day, yo. You know, I'm starting to see what Kanan was getting at. Yes, but we must exercise caution, lest our teamwork be branded as rule-breaking. Be nice if we could just take down the top dogs on our own. But how are we supposed to know if we stand a chance against them? We still don't know who it is we're up against. And even if we do stand a chance, can we really make it home? So, any thoughts, Ren dude? Huh? We told you what we think. What about you? I'm still thinking. Well, make up your mind. I just need more time. How much time? More. Well, how many hours is more? We can't keep Khan on waiting. I know. Now can you give me a friggin' break already? Just because you jump off Tokyo Tower if Kanon asked. And what's that supposed to mean? How are you so sure she won't try to screw us over? <sighs> I mean, I'm not 100% sure, but still. Then maybe you should think a little harder for once. <sighs> Look, 
All I was saying is that it might be a good idea to team up with her. That's all. And if we can pull it off without her help, then that's even better. We've all made up our minds, so I figured you had too. I will, okay? I just need more time. Uh oh. Sure, we don't have much left. Only two more days until another one bites the dust. Clock's ticking, buddy. I get it already. <sighs> Doesn't make this any easier. I can't just rush a big decision like this. <gasps> it's Swallow. I know you're here with me. Come on, just tell me. No more secrets. <gasps> so you are here. I knew it. What? You knew who I was this whole time? Shit. Uh, so yeah, who the fuck is Swallow? Who the fuck is Swallow? Oh man! <sighs> Rough, buddy. Rough. That sounds pretty wild. Are you sure you'll be okay? Huh, that's a new one. Lucky I managed to get through to you then. Don't worry, I'll do everything I can. Information is the key to victory. And I've got that key right on my fingertips. Who the fuck is that? Who the funky fuck is that? <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. Yo! <sighs> yo! It's already day five. Yep, sure is. Listen, I've given it some thought and... <sighs> Just the mission. Make tracks for O East. There you will find the key to the target. The upheaval rule is once more in effect. Teams lower in the ranking will earn more points if they succeed. The revolution returns. Huh? That's new. Anyway, let's bounce. O East. <clears throat> you appear somewhat unwell of late. I'm fine. Can't hear you, champ. So, make up your mind yet, Rin dude? You did say you gave it some thought. Yeah. So... Hey, now there's a sight for sore eyes. What's happening, Skulls? Lollipop? Get out of here, yo! So, to what do I owe the pleasure? Got so hungry for some action that you came back for seconds? Crow and boys gotta eat, you feel me? <laughs> Glad to see you haven't lost your sense of humor, man. But enough small talk. I want to know what you kids said to Uzuki about me. Uh, about you? Hmm, pretty sure we just mentioned how you're really cool and super chill. Huh, I... Interesting. Makes a reaper wonder why she decided to tear me a new one then. So she did teach you a lesson or three. Felt more like four or five at least. <laughs> she also told me something else I wasn't too thrilled about. Said you kids weren't actually dead, but I couldn't believe it. 
Believe it, yo. A lot of things have changed this time around. Thinking them Shinjuku Reapers is up to something. Eh, could be. If you want to know their grand plan, you're asking the wrong guy. Yeah, Pinky ain't had a clue neither. Yo, there always been bad blood with you and Shinjuku? Not always. We got along just fine at first. Even offered to give them all a new home when their old one got torn down. Welcome to Shibuya, folks. Wasn't expecting so much company. What the hell happened up there? An inversion. Go on. It was tragic, really. Our little game was just heating up. When all of a sudden, the boundary between the UG and the RG just melted away, taking our beloved Shinjuku with it into the ether. We're the only survivors, and none of us are any the wiser as to why such tragedy befell us. I speak on behalf of us all when I say we'd be eternally grateful if you offered us shelter, gracious Game Master. Pinky was the GM? Three years ago, but not for long. Somebody had to step up after you and Phones took down the powers that were. Hey, yeah. Almost forgot about all that. One can only imagine how. I know I sure can't. I don't believe I was speaking to you. <laughs> imagine that. So, you saying Pinky got duped like some kind of chump? Go easy on the poor girl, will ya? Besides, it's kinda my fault for going against Shiba. He doesn't take kindly to naysayers. That's why there's so few of us left. You don't roll with the punches, you get knocked out. Y'all had it rougher than I thought. Anyway, like I was saying, I don't know what your team's deal is, but I'd love to know who's responsible. I mean, it's gotta be the Shinjuku gang, right? Yeah, sure looks that way. Uh, so you already know who's responsible? It'd certainly make the most sense, seeing as they're the ones who called you here in the first place. Anyway, keep playing along for now. Roll with the punches, you feel? <coughs> Catch you later. After all that, his advice is just keep playing? It's all we can do for now, yo. Thinking ain't gonna get us nowhere. Let's take care of the mission. Right, Rendo? Right. Uh, oh, East. Hmm. What to do? Today's mission someone could use help near 104. Express under and scramble crossing. Got a new pin on square. Great question mark. The great balloon voyage. Is an R one. Yeah, I was about to say the Great Balloon Voyage we already did. So, you... Two kids got some good stuff for you today. 
What are you doing back here? Nice to see you too, Ryoji. How are those flowers of mine selling? Does it look like still got a bunch of them laying around? But sell them early or they all wilt. Make sure they are gone by the end of the day. I would hope you would have sold them all yesterday, but here we are. Have you thought about not forcing your junk on me in the first place? Can't say that I have. Besides, you're the one who insisted on doing everything yourself. Fine, a man repays his debts, and I do owe you for everything. Hell if I know. Thanks, I'll be back later to check on you. Fuck. Damn it, why do I have to get saddled with this? Hey, you kids got some spare time? Absolutely not, we're super busy and we came to the shop not work. At least hear me out, it's about a rumor floating around Shibuya. They say that if you give a certain special flower to your certain special someone, you will suddenly share a magical bond of love or some shit. Sounds fishy. If one flower and your boo will take on all your pain, give a whole bouquet and you take on their troubles instead. Hmm. I think I've heard that one somewhere before. And? And this is it. This is the flower. It's almost impossible to sell. I'm driving myself crazy trying to get rid of them. Get out there and do a little advertising for me, will you? I don't know. This whole deal is shady. But we can't just leave brother hanging, yo. Besides, we could use a breather. Let's ha have it. Additionally, we will have to assist if we wish to assess his wares. So you'll do. So you do it? Great. Sure, but maybe don't expect too much. By the way, this type of iris is the official flower of Shibuya, correct? Ask me, Sites, the flower changes depends on where you hear the rumor, so it's not likely to matter. Interesting, each location gets a different flower. Hey. So what are you trying to get people to buy? Single flowers or case? There's bold plan too. If you want to try that. Oh, those? That's the... Yeah. Access old that old man dumped on me. X stock. They're all the same to me. Just want them gone. So get out there, find me some customers. At least five to start. Really? Now I've got a quota. All right, how we do this? Not much we can do aside from imprinting. If we wish to sell these single flowers in case. It would be best to leverage the notoriety of the urban legend. Anyone who isn't interested in rumors can try the pulp plants. Precisely, although I remain doubtful that we can sell an entire stock. Well, let's try starting with people who know about the rumor. Sounds good. Standing by and ready to scan. Shit. At least we found the piggy! Take a look at me. Let's have a look. Gotta focus. Can't believe she got injured right before the big match. What should I bring to cheer up? A good luck charm would be too much. How about some flowers?
Oh, good plant. Recommended. How about a pulled plant? No, that'd be way too much work for her to take care of, but it's such a great idea. Gotta tell the girls about it. Got one, one down, four to go. I could feel the blood rushing to my head when she dumped me. Gotta calm down and take my mind off it. Buy a pool with plants. Taking care of pulled plant will definitely get my mind of this. And would you look at that? They're selling some right there. Easy clap. We're on a roll, yo. Yeah, and just need three more. This sucks. My boss asked me to look into that urban legend, but could this shop's flower be the real deal? Ma manic flower? Just sounds fake. Single flower. Recommended. The slurs painted my ass off. You know, if I post the details online, so I'm sure to buy one first and save me the trouble. Work smart. How many is that now? Three. So two more. Let's have a look. I heard a man was selling the flowers from the urban legend around here, but I don't see anyone like that. Maybe that guy over there has some for sale. Get by. Should I buy a bouquet? I don't know if it's the one from the urban legend, but at least it'll make a great story. Piece of cake, almost done. Just one more. I really do not like Kinesis. Kinesis is annoying because the damage you deal is reliably not always the same. Depending on the weight of the item that you throw on an enemy. Ain't no stop us now! 
Got this in the bag. There's so many different pins in this game, man. It's like insane. I don't think I'm even halfway through it yet. Also, I didn't realize, but we're on a new color of frogs. These are orange and purple. The last ones we've seen were blue. Before that, they were green with blue. I'm going to join the movie watcher. See ya. Eco, thank you very much for stopping by, dude. Enjoy the movie night. Kind of decent or is garbage? It's garbage. Ooh, what's that? Is that a noise metal? Kinky. Relying on the reliable. My friend won't shut up about that flower from the urban legends. He says if it's true, I should give some to my girl. But I have my doubts about relying on something like that. Buy it. Just buy it. Hey, I'll just buy one. But giving a single flower transfers your pain to the receiver, right? Should I get more? No, one and done. A show. Right. One and done, Zos. <laughs> hey, good job out there. Words really getting around. Hello again, Ryoji. Selling those flowers, I hope. Yep, almost right. sold out. Impressive. Who knew there was so much money in Urban Legends? These kids, don't mind them, they just help me out here and there. Anyway, you happy now, or you got something else to gripe about? Everything is in order. I already made more than I thought I would. I'll be back when I find something else for you to do for me. Don't work too hard. Don't work those kids too hard. Let's leave us out of this. Be better if that geezer never comes back. Anyways, thanks for the help. Take this. Thanks. I better get back to selling the usual stuff. Feel free to help by buying. Feel free to help by buying something on the, your way out. Or the Calicum friendship points. Got a handyman. Look who's here. Ooh, do I need to trade this? I need three Blizzard Bunny and through Azamaru. What the. F Fuck sticks.
Azamaru, Jupiter. Lizard Bunny. What to do? Hey, allows you to equip another Uber Bin. Neat. Sure. Let's move. Sir. And this way, now before you do a little something for me, and that is take down some noise with this symbol. Okay. Been paid to go easy on you just once enough. But who would pay you off like that? You gonna look gift and mission in the mouse. Don't waste your time thinking about it, kid. Just defeat one noise and you're golden. Hey, Sap. How are you doing, dude? I can do this. Show grill, I like your sketches of me. Nice. Gotta do a nude one with a little enhanced PP. I think your brain needs a little bit of enhancement, bruh. Not your PP. Set resub, 41 months made, Jesus fucking Christ. Sep has been subbed for way too long. I get PP insults. No, no brain insults, your PP is fine. Fucking do, Yordi. Are you still alive? Let's move. Don't feel very alive. Okay. I see. Kyoko Sweets! Oh, 
upgrade that style. I gotta pose IRL for naked drawings, though. I know you were. <clears throat> That's why I continued on to it. Why do you gotta do that, though? Can't you blaze? Wait. I think I already have this one, right? Jesus, this is all new stuff. Expensive as well. Thank you kindly. Let me have a look. Kachu Blaze. Kachu Blaze. Kachu. Birdies. It is Enjo Blaze. No baka baka baka! Aka Fuji Blaze Streets Yeah, got him. Here it is. Asking you why. Let's have a look. Let's move. Asking you why, Nani? Didn't ask anything. I'd love to. None does. Ah, oh, jeez, can't get anything right. I'll never make it on my own like this. It's not like it's my fault, though. It's all because stupid Ryoji. If he'd bother to actually teach me a single damn thing, I wouldn't be in this mess. What's up with him? You think it's noise? Doubtful. We have encountered him before once. We have already seen the inside of his mind, and it should be free of intruders. Oh yeah, I think I remember that. He was posting those puzzles for Ryoji, right? Correct, and although he does appear to be troubled, this is an issue separate from any noise. <laughs> Ugly. <laughs> uh, you already can, I don't know, are you? <laughs> I don't draw men in, uh, like, French girls. I only draw girls like French girls. My mom and grandma call me handsome, so no. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Sep. Uh, nothing, it's not like he's asking for help. Aw, oh, come on, give him a scan, can't hurt. Let's have a look. I've been nothing but a failure since I started being my own boss, but it's all Ryoji's fault. He taught me a smidgen of what he knew. Uh, I wouldn't be in this mess. Hmm, he certainly is quick to shift the blame away from himself. Think I should jog his memory? About what? About all the stuff uh, Ryoji told him back when they worked together. But he said he, the brother never told him nothing. Yeah, but do you really believe that? Maybe he just forgot and doesn't even remember that he forgot. You lost me. Anyway, I'm gonna go see it. I'm gonna go for it, see what happens. Hey, complain, do you think? Tell me it's not hilarious. Okay, it's not hilarious. Try to remember. The key to success. Apparently, I shouldn't rely on reviews too much. No use working hard if no one knows who you are. Get the word out, and the customers will come to you. Even a jackfall trade needs help sometimes, so you shouldn't try to do everything alone. Or so I was told. I don't really get it, though I guess I still have a lot to learn. That it? That's it? I've had it been being treated like this. I'm quitting this stupid job. Hang on, I did learn a thing or two from Ryoji, like how to advertise and how to get your name out there. I haven't been doing that at all. What else? There was also the importance of not doing everything yourself. I mean, I am doing everything myself, but what's wrong with that? Maybe that's my problem. I need to think this through a little better. But once I'm done, I'm going to be the greatest Jack of all trades Shibuya has ever seen. 
Uh, I guess you're a 5 out of 10, lol, how can you tell? Sep is, uh, Sep is by Ellen IG. I give myself 7 out of 10. See, I told you he was forgetting something. Right. Uh, uh, oh, way to go, man. Shucks, you're making me blush. Anyway, we better get back to the mission. Yeah. Uh, thoughts. Chain extender. Dope. Wow, suddenly Yordi is broke again. Fucking Fs. Are you looking for nice day? Let's move. Gotta focus. says um <sighs> let me go back to the UG see which ones I needed again Shibu ya hikari Yeah, Lizzie would be super happy. As a Mario and Blizzard bunny. Game. As a Mario and Blizzard bunny. As a Mario and Blizzard bunny. Okay, so as a Mario, this one is Jupiter of the Monkey. And a Blizzard bunny. Is Kongi Cox all the way on the east where we need to go? Tower Records. Hey there, dude. Wait for wheels? Scheiße, Jupiter is blocked. You do come again. Well, howdy. Have a good one. Let's move. Let's have a look. Sure, let's make a little bit of a mess here.
get a grip, yo. Weak. Just don't tell Yordi I follow him other. Otherwise he'll he'll think he's famous. Yeah, SQ is so complex, so smart, yet so stupid. <laughs> You guys continue to be a special bunch. And I love you all for it. Just don't tell Yordi. I follow him. Otherwise, he'll think he is famous. Yeah, that's what I read. I love you too, Yordi. Glad. Glad you do. Otherwise, I'd be feeling kind of lonesome. Up, brother. So, so scared. We are so scared of that term. The previous one. Love. I'm not scared of that term. I'm only scared of it once it starts being non-platonic.
Come on, give me something heavy. Yeah, that's what I like to see. No, it's Q. That is not okay. Could you be be loved? Can't you be loved and be loved? Could you be loved? <laughs> Nani? Yeah, you're receiving money again. Okay, get rid of this stupid ass pin. Useless. Oh, was I using again on you? I think it was this one. There's no song request today, Seppi to Peppy. Dipsy Toes Home. Hi there. Come again soon. Hello. Or just Tokyo hands. No, keep it. You have to master it for trophy. Wait, I have to master what for trophy? I didn't sell anything. I didn't get rid of anything. Let me think this through. 104. We're going there soon. Monopro trick cards. This one is new. Swordy shoes. This hat. That. Okay, noise. Dog tags. I'm bouncing to that lovely song. Noise. Good, glad. Let's move. Cryo hey records. Thanks. Come back soon. Balsam hungry. I hungry, I'm boss. <laughs> and now we can eat, yo. Man, I am starving. This tastes pretty good. Please come again soon. Let's move.
You shoot to you twat. Nani. What to do? Let's move. I'm drunk, excuse me. There are trophies for mastering 100 pins, 200 pins, and 300 pins. Yeah, I know. I've been mastering all pins. I'm working on all of them. Let's move. Hello. Uh, Lonely Space Warriors done. Day off outside is also done because this is the one that Coming evolves. In. I'm almost on a hundred. Seeing as you can't maximize these. Let's move. Yeah. Let's have a look. Okay, eight. <clears throat> I suppose combat is inevitable. Let's do it. SQ the gaming queen. Kiryu-chan! Nice one, that girl! Get a grip, yo. That's good. That's good, SQ. Glad you're enjoying it. Stop smacking me around, yo! Couldn't 
die if it don't watch out. Actually horrible at gaming, but yo, it's a big deal that I got 89% trophies. Yeah, that's a lot. Guess it's just easy and I'm still shit. You're not shit, SQ. You should be proud of what you've achieved. Fucking bears, man. And you spend 125 on game as like 40 story hours. Yeah, but that's always the case with RPGs when it comes to completing.
Jesus Christ. That was a little bit more scary than I uh, wanted to admit. Station. This one is just a regular triangle. Yeah, okay, let's go with a regular triangle for the time being and then put... Inspiring Aura. This one evolves. Kick off. Start with this one. Let's move. Uh oh. If you're going this way, you're gonna have to fight your way through. I'll bring the noise you br bring the fight. Sure. It's not too bad. Ready? Galaxy Brain, activate! <laughs> this box is done for. Boom! Slap. <clears throat> no chance. Doku, Doku panic. Gotta, gotta. Rank four. You took him out already. I knew you. I should have made him stronger. <laughs> Me? What stronger? The noise just now, stupid. Not to make you work for it, but orders or orders. Wait, someone ordered you to go easy on us. Something like that. But don't think this makes you anywhere near a match for the Roombringers. Melikoni x Melikoni sent three arching boomerangs hurling. That's another L1 that we can use. What to do? 104 could use our help. I'm all set. It's go time. I foresee no difficulties. Holy shit. Green burbs. Yeah. 
At least these fuckers don't pick me up and just, like, drag me around the entire time. Turn up the volume, yo. Keep it up, Fred! What up, Sep? What you danging about, boy? I'm feeling nice as fuck. Well, at least some of us are. Lovely stream. There's SQ with shenanigans. I'm a little drunk. Evening looks good as fuck. Only a little bit drunk, Sep.
You exist and that is good and a good thing. Feels like something that was said in the game not too long ago. Stupid one cleared. Okay, uh, stupid one is done. Replace four. Anything useful on triangle? Punches Rock and Rockin Rock and Rockin. Hey, we haven't completed this one yet. Oh, at least someone is glad I exist. Come back now. Hello there. Farewell. Hmm. Welcome. Thanks. Come again soon. Thanks. Come again soon. Let's have a look. Oh, the prince is not a very princely. Kind of a lot of healing ones. There's a chain. I need damage. Pure destructive damage. Okay. Um. The prince is just standing there, looking all forlorn. What's up, you think? Maybe he's coming up with a new recipe or something. Oh, the whole deep in thought look is really doing it for me. He likes the presents I gave him. Hey, it's the prince. Who's that? Friend of yours? If only. He's super famous. Do you seriously not know? Never heard of him. But ain't celebrities usually more, I don't know, happy? Happy? Indeed. This is quite the departure from when we last saw him. He does seem kind of out of it. I'm going to Galaxy Brain. Ooh, dude, has got a noise problem. Say what, yo, Penny, you want it? I suppose so, we can hardly leave him in this state. Damn straight, to, rescue, to the prince's rescue we go. Single flower, it makes me think of Iris, my old caretaker. Huh. I feel so drained all of a sudden, I can barely bring myself to move. I proceed, then? Onward, I dive. <clears throat> Out, my nut. All your asses is grass. Let's do this. Yeah. Follow me, yo. Perfecto. Yeah! 
Such sadness, like I've lost someone dear to me. Asus, if you want a pack, it's the coffee at Hachiko Cafe. If you want a pack, it's... Oh. Yeah, no, I'm fine. I'm, uh... Uh, just, uh, doing shits. I just need uh, a more physical damaging move if I want to at least try and get a decent score on this. Which is not gonna happen. How are you, Sush? That one is going to evolve? No? Okay, it means it's done a single flower. What was that just now? As soon as I took that flower, a cold emptiness washed over me. I must have been more tired than I thought. You can be as tired as you need to be. We will still love you. Here, take this. I really hope you like it. Prince, I got this flower for you. It'll cheer you up. Why, thank you. It's almost as lovely as you ladies. Now, if you'll excuse me. Shall we consider this case closed? Yeah, he's fine. But we never found out where the noise came from. Uh, ain't no easy being famous, no privacy, people bugging you all the time. Maybe all that just got to him. <laughs> yeah, it'd be real tough being a so popular word. I'm Sir Sleepslot. <laughs> Is that so, Sush? <laughs> Have you been sleeping a lot, sir? Uh, anyone non Uber? Uh, I could probably do this one as a non Uber on L1. Kind of depends. This is also an L1, so no. I can't. Fucking Christ. Oh yeah, let's just go with Kumokuri. It's not too bad. It's not amazing, but it's not too bad. Did I end up going into the stores? Well, hey. Welcome back now. 
So, Yori, how do you feel about Beat being so fucking hot? Well, so fucking hot is not how I would describe him. But I do dig uh, the the look. It's different from how he was, though. Like, that was kind of a surprise. But yeah, I ain't got no complaints. Here. Manami Akita, best bud, sometimes increase the groove earned from beat drops combos performed by Rindo and Fred. Fred, not D. Phew. Let's have a look. Gotta focus. Piggy. Let's move. You know, deal clear our mission, pass through the wall. I want you to bring me flying high pin number 2070. Drop one for you. Nefastraven. It's like a raven, shouldn't be too hard to find. But I'm asking you to do it unless you don't want to get through. Up on. I think I have that one already. What is Raven? Could overcome. Maybe I don't have it yet. Mental note, flying high. Twenty seven. No, nope, don't have that one yet. Noise PDM. Okay, I guess I need to clear it out because it drops on normal, I guess. When you're catching cold or something, why you cough like a grandpa? I always cough like a grandpa. Let's have a look. Maybe that's a little bit much, uh, Yordi. Don't need to you don't need to respond them, you can just swap the normal. But I don't wanna swap to normal. Take a look at me. Dialogue, what does Beat say? Beat says you stink. It's not what he said, I'm just kidding. Yes, me. I do feel like I stink today. I haven't showered. So I wouldn't be surprised if I actually stank. Up the volume, yo. That 
was perfect. Take a look at me. That's not the one be my last. Oh, it's a normal square. Oh, but I need a triangle working on the square. Okay, what did Sushi say? Just said it's normal. Doesn't respawn, though. Boonga boonga. I think it can handle eights on normal. Leave it to me, yo! I don't know. You get different drop rates, that's for sure, on different items on different difficulties. That is a proven fact. Just follow my lead. Oompa loompa boompa doompas. Right. 
Boom. Hey, shark. I went into eight, I think, right? Three more. Just follow my lead! Fucking bird. Oh, the bird got blown up. Cool, cool. I think we've got this. Hey, 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 hey. Clean. Last shark. Our party is equipped to win. It's over. Move. Move it, yo. It's over. Heads up. Can look at me. Boom. Noise erased. Damn. Guess I ain't on my game today. Took seven minutes. 
Great Balloon Voyage. Nice, there's one clear. Two clear. Be my last. Did I still not get the one that I needed? Are you kidding me? Be my last. That's the one that I get from these. Nefastraven should drop that pin you need. But it doesn't. Do I need to do it on easy? Please tell me you're bullshitting me, game. Uh, at least we got most of these completed. Put this one in for L2. Just put in another one, an R1 or something, while we're at it. Okay, let me reset this room. take the other route, but honestly, I already made the decision of not doing that. Nice one, Rin dude.
Oder, 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 oder. me yo me yo Four now, I think. Yeah. Three more. Smack that all on the floor, smack that, give me some more, smack that, till you get so smack that. Yuri Yuri does a Child abuse, Sep. Lord, it appears our efforts were insufficient. 
Eh, eh, flying high, the world within is also a new one. Okay, that's one max that- Aw, oh, fangs and ice. Slash cool. Children are devils. Typical SQ reply. Still playing on easier difficulty. Flows through you. Oh, this is going to be easy. Worth the pain, yo. Thinking to challenge myself when I'm done with trophies of Tewa, I'll finish the game in hard. Go for it! Done. 
By finishing the game, I mean beats the final boss, who is 64. So you're not gonna complete it, SQ? Not gonna get all trophies, SQ? Here I thought you were gonna do something badass. One Rin dude. be a hundred. <laughs> I'll try. But at least trying is better than doing nothing. <sighs> okay, that one is done as well. Oh, fuck. Headliner. This one, this sucks. I'll put Yuki on while we do this one. Lovebird Magnum. Is that one new? Check it in a moment. I think I'll do this one. Love Bird Magnum. No, we haven't complete Love Bird Magnum yet. Okay. Let's just put me a bit on these. I pray tell. I heard there's some nasty stuff in store for you. Nasty stuff in store for me? Like what? And he's gone. Put it back to hard. Rindo. Hey, Rindude. What's up? About this whole working together with Camel thing? Oh, I... I think I haven't thought it through properly, but even if Kano wasn't involved, Still think it's the best for us to do something, you know, Fred. I and I know we haven't seen eye to eye on lots of stuff this week. And it's like I really suck at these kind of conversations, you know. First, I thought things would just work themselves out, that we could just go with the flow. Man, I really don't want to get erased. I know, Fred. Me neither. Thought really hard, just like you said, and I think we should team up with Canon. Yeah, you're right. Oh. I thought about it too, and decided it was our best option. Is that really your decision? I mean, yeah. Insofar as I decide that to take Swallow's advice, well then, that's great. You know, it's weird. You're always bitching about this and that. I am. But when it, come, when it comes time to make decisions and do something, you, you've got nothing to say. So I guess that's progress. Sorry. 
It's just I can't spring into action like you. I need more time. And I'm sorry I couldn't make a decision sooner. Don't sweat, pal. Can't expect you to change the way you are. And hey, at least you came to the right decision, I guess. Kidoki, let's hit up Kanon. Looks like they finally decided on something. You good with that, Nagi? While my fears are not entirely assured, I shall defer to Lord Rindo's decision. At the very least, I'm relieved the tension in the air is to say that this is how teams should be, friendly and peaceful. Or so I believe. Me too, yo. How nice to have a kindred spirit. Man, this reminds me of the old days. I mean, we ain't dead like the old days. But we're still just cut off from the RG as we were was before. It's a limited life we lead. We are but birds in a cage, trapped behind bars, and meticulously supervised. At least y'all ain't gotta carry around those player pins no more. It was my understanding that we did. For reals? How come I don't get one? Perchance you already did? They were circulating in Argina long ago. That thing? Yeah, I got one here. Hold up, yo. The day I got my Sykes back, that's the same day I got this pin from a buddy at school. Token of their affection, perhaps? Doubt it. Why do you ask? No reason other than mere curiosity. However, your tale does remind me of a similar experience of my own. I had embarked on a preliminary inspection of the upcoming Elstra event space and coincidentally came into possession of this mysterious pin. It was only after obtaining said pin that I found myself suddenly able to enter people's minds. Oh, what you talking about? Something juicy? These pins, you all remember when you picked them up? Pretty sure it was last week. Yeah, the same day we started playing the Reapers game. Just a thought. I still don't get it, but I'm getting closer. So, you do get it or you don't? I believe he means to suggest we've come to the OG because we acquired these pins in the RG. Kubo did say something about it being easier for them this way. In which case, perhaps the pins serve less as an identifier, more as an invitation. Hmm. Mm, didn't Mr. Minami say something about your pin letting you turn back time too? He sure did. So if these pins is the only reason we can use our Sykes... What happens if I smash mine to bits? Oh, slow down there, cowboy. Trust me, you do not want to do that. You might end up erasing yourself. That hypothesis certainly holds water when one factors in that we cease to exist in the RG. Hmm, is it just me? Or does mine look even more different than before? Yeah, it's evolving. Tiger punks. See you around then. Welcome. Okay, so I can't buy more Blizzard Bunny. I know I can get more Blizzard Bunny, though. I just need to figure out where exactly this one, Blizzard Bunny. Noise PDM. Lockbird Magnum. Tasty oven snack. Okay, so the emo prefers on hard drop the bunnies. Loon trip. Fuya, out of your mind. Good luck, tune. Psyched pure heart. Fair beauty. Psyched fair beauty. Go go a berry gay. Suzukuchi, Mr. Mew. Okay. Let's go. I 
Alright, we made it. Now what? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'll be borrowing your leader if you don't mind. That's you, Rindude. Just me. Just you. By your lonesome. What do I do? Just head inside. Correct. You'll get your mission once you're in. Come on. Let's get it over with. Take care, Lord Rindo. Best of luck. Am I gonna have to do fighting on my own? It's pitch dark. Hello? Can't see anything in here. What the hell's going on? Damn, locked. Tell me I'm trapped in here. What? Submission. To obtain your freedom, guide the outsiders to the four keys and decode outsiders. Does that mean threaten them? Fail and your imprisonment will extend until the end of the final day. Jeez, what do we do? Are we the outsiders? Oh my, I had hoped my premonition would be less accurate. Gotta get Rindo out of there. We can't get through the week without him. Where are these keys at? It's Rindo. You okay in there? If we are the outsiders to be guided, it stands that Lord Rindo must be the one to guide us from within. Let's see what he's got for us. Just got the mission. I think all of the clues only come to me. Hang on. Tower Records, Scramble Crossing, Express, Underway, Tipsy Toes Hall. Apparently there are four hidden letters. I have to solve some kind of puzzle with them. But you guys have to find them, obviously. Sweet. Now we know where to go. Okay. Alright, gang. Where to first? Tower Records first on the list. Sounds as strategy as any. Time to move. Well, it looks like we won't be teaming up with Kano just yet. Speaking of Kanon. Hey Kanon, in No, but she might be trapped somewhere else. I'm guessing our mission is probably similar. Maybe we can help each other out, I'll ask. Yeah yeah. Uh... There's Tower Records, so what are we supposed to do? Any heard anything from Rindo? Hang on, let me check. At Tower Records. The key is marked on the back of the 10 numbered one. Whatever that means, 10 numbered one. Something with 10 numbers. Mm. Greetings! Whoa, Sir Kaye? If you find yourself lost, perhaps I can assist. I will not be charging for fortunes told today. Really? Why though? Today's mission brings with it great uncertainty. It is simply my desire to put you at ease, to guide you to your leader's absence. I will be offering free assistance to all players today. And if you're satisfied with my fortune-telling services and wish to utilize them at a later date, I look forward to providing them at my usual rates. Personally, orthodox sales tactic. Call me whenever you please, Godspeed. What? Sure acts funny for a reaper. Hmm. Man, they all act funny if you ask me. At least we have someone to help if we get stuck. So shall we begin? We're on the lookout for 10 numbers. They gotta be around here somewhere. The ten numbered one. On the back of the ten numbered one. This is not gonna be easy, is it? Mm -hmm. The phone booth keypad got ten numbers on it. And back of it? Hmm, there's something here, look. Good job, Yordi. You guessed correctly. A. The letter A. I presume this is our first key. Curious, though, it appears though it was better hidden previously. Someone has made it suspiciously conspicuous. Are we doing on time? Fine, but we better book it to the next place. Hmm. Oh, it's Rindo. Maybe something's up. Talk to Kano and her mission is almost just like ours. Nice. We can help each other out. Just with different clues. Ah, oh, that makes sense. We agree to to each to do our own thing. And if we end up with some spare time, we lend each other a hand. Aha! That's a pretty solid plan, actually. Where you head next? I'm... I'm just... I was just guessing. Hey team, where to now? Scramble crossing? I... No objections here. Scrambled next. Got it. 
All right, dudes, away we go. Ark, we have arrived at the Scramble Crossing. I'll ask Nerendo what to do next. Head to the crossing. The key shimmers on the back of Liberation Harbringer. There's pick two. Uh, I guess that's who you're looking for. What a drag. So we're looking for this chick among this horde of pedestrians. It's like, keep your glasses on straight, because this is going to be tough. She is here. There she is, right there. Get her. Poor choice in words, but phrasing aside, Shelly Forth. Yes, this is her. This is definitely her, right? Mm -hmm. Or not? Nah, that's her. Bet my board on it. Sweet. Okay, where's the letter? Shimmering on her back, as you may recall. Huh? Son of a... Heads up, noise incoming. Yeah, out of flipping nowhere. Bet one of them Reapers agreed they would never afford us to clue so easily. Let's crush him! Do we actually have to fight? Okay, I only have two offensive guys right now. That's... Thankfully, Beats one is fairly OP. Did I forget to change uh, difficulty back to hard? Don't think so, right? According to the color, that was a uh, nope. Didn't change. I didn't forget to change back. We did it, now we just have to- where'd she go? She was just here. What? That way, which way? Or Tachiko, don't let her get away. Five thousand yen. Where the hell did she go? Don't tell me she had to catch a train. Cool it, yo, just gotta keep looking. But make haste, time marches ever forward. Holy fucks. Oh, I see her. She's like right here. And there are no noise in the vicinity quickly. Now is our chance. Fine, now where the heck is this key? Shimmering on the, her back is what it told me. Perhaps satchel hanging from her shoulders? E. S got an E on it. A nice sparkling one. That's good enough for me. Great, although I pray the remain keys shan't take as long to locate. No kidding. It's just rude making us look for one specific girl in a place like this. I where next? Since we're just going down the line, express underpass next. Discern in five truths where the image becomes real. There's another picture, by the way. Discern the five truths where the image becomes real. Uh... Well, I'm already lost, Penny. Oh, I wish you wouldn't look at me in such a way. The scene in this photograph is the same as our view from our current vintage point. Discern five truths the image becomes real, perhaps. This is a simple game of find the difference. Huh. 
Yeah, that's not exactly my forte. You two are awfully quick to surrender. With all our wits combined, we're sure to solve this in no time. This same picture as the one we received from Lord Rindo, except with five locations marked. Just be a hint, sure as heck looks like one to me. Think one help Reapers is helping us? It would certainly seem that way. Could one of the other players be offering them financial encouragement? Well, however they are, we ought to thank them for this little answer sheet. But what you're looking at answers for, yo. Uh, so we can be done with it. Ain't no fun in cheating, man. Let's just use that as last resort. Can I agree more now than commence the search? Okay, um... One. What am I supposed to make of it? Beats me. Do you not see the light here? There's one more than there's rightful should be. Oh, now that you mention it, it kind of does look different. It doesn't look different, it is different. You say something? Not at all. Moving on. Um... I'm actually not bad at these kind of things. Found one. What? Where? Peep this graffiti on the street. Oh, wow. Totally missed that. Way to go, dude. It's nothing. Just leave it to your boy, Beat. He certainly looks pleased with himself. Moving right along. Um, boot -doo -doo. That seems the same. Okay, I take it back. I said I was kind of good at this, but apparently I'm now failing canonically. I got the obvious ones already, like the two obvious ones. Oh, I see something here. No, there's nothing. That person. Nothing, obviously. Five truths. <clears throat> I've only found two so far and I can't find more. Damn, this sucks. It's not... doesn't have anything to do with moving objects. That's one th thing I can be certain of. There's another board here. Grass and trees are the same. That's the same for here. That pool is there. This is here. Can't find it. Nope. There's an extra line here. Uh -huh. 
Pretty awesome, right? Don't pretend you're not impressed. As impressed as one could be with a Zectogram. A Zepto, uh, what does that mean again? Pay no mind. Some things are best left forgotten. Come on, we're not finished yet. Oh, shit, Sherlock. Oh, look. This... Hmm. Hey, look closely. What are we looking for? The line stops on the street. Notice anything amiss? Kinda, maybe. It sh I should think it's rather obvious. No matter where one... No one step closer to our goal. Okay. Um, the last one, Jesus. <sighs> They're all, all pretty obviously located, even though you can pretty much look over them as well. Controller is becoming empty again. I'm thinking I'm looking too far into the background. Feel like I should be able to see it easier. How much longer are we gonna keep doing this? And what do you propose is different about that? Nothing, that's what's too long for my taste. Listen, can we just, you know, take a look? Take a look at what, yo? That other pick we got, the one with all the answers. A rather heavy handed set of hints. Let's take a peek, hold up. You seriously find a cheat, yo? It's too hard, true. Heck yeah, let's look at the other pick. Cheating time, it's either that or Ask Kai for help. Words, don't want to waste no more time. What the fuck is different there? I see. They do appear to be correct by my judgment. They really are different. No, they're not. Like the last one I didn't notice. Oh, fucking hell, I'm blind. Now we know for sure these answers are right. It's five, which means we got them all. Way to go, team. Balcony windows are... Five truths have been revealed. Followed by the letter R. <clears throat> it is still unclear how we are meant to use these letters. Tipsy Toes Hall. That one sucks, man. I take back. I'm never saying I'm good at something again and get blasted like this. Here we are, Tipsy Toes Hall. What do we do here? Let me check. Okay, all three of you? Of course. Duh. From east to west, from north west to north, south west to north, from northwest to southeast. When three lenses align, one will reveal your guide. Find the guide, find the key. What? Think the lenses mean cameras, so you need to look at three different places through your camera or something. Uh... Oh, so that's why you wanted to make sure we were all here. 
cool. We shall each cover one of the listed directions. East, South, West, North, West. Cameras what? can show us then. But how are we gonna know what the difference Indeed. between them? Excellent point, we <clears throat> had some method observing each other's devices. My apologies, in another sudden appearance. I really forgot to supply you with the tools you need that would have earned me a scolding. Allow me to update your RNS pitlay applications. Only take a moment. Okay. It got updated. You are now able to share your screen with your teammates while using camera. Useful in the context of this puzzle, no? Oh yeah, it is. Thanks, man. Okay, seriously? What is with all the help today? Let's just say a certain someone is working to ensure your success. Who might that be? Someone who has your best interests at heart. Just Saidu. Well, best of luck out there. We doing this, yo. Dibs on Southwest. He says while racing Northeast, no matter, I will cover Northwest. Get at least East with me this way, right? It seems like enough space to spot everyone good. The preparations are complete. Yeah, I'm here. Camera's rolling. When three lenses align, one will reveal your guide. We have to find something on the screen that isn't on the others. Shit, I thought we was done with this find a difference ball. Oh, this is gonna suck. Perhaps? No, that can't be right. Yeah, no shit. I don't know what... Like, this is absolutely disgusting. I don't like this puzzle at all. Find the guide. Gotta find something that isn't visible on the other screens. I really don't like this one. Okay, I can see... Uh, not fret, but uh, dingy here. You are here, and that means we're on fret here. Wait a sec. This girl here is not visible from... Oh my god, I think this is it. She's our guide. Are we supposed to get up all close and personal? I think I found it. Okay, where'd she go? Perhaps a look through the camera could provide you an answer. Does that work? Like AR or something? Who cares? Just do it. Alright. Still not seeing anything. You sure there was someone there? Viewing from the east may prove useful, alright? Uh, See anything? Sure do, and it's creepy as all get out. Looks like a ghost. Hey man, don't try and scare me like that. Most fascinating. It looks like our spooky pal left us a dying message convenient. It's just one letter. P. A perfectly presentable P. Jesus Christ, that was hard. You better let Rindo know on it. Well, that's all for back to East then. I must say, I feel strange leaving this operation here. A lonesome it must be, stand watching in one place without end. Yeah. And people passing by not even knowing you're there. Whoever came up with this puzzle has some serious issues to work through.
That's all the letters. Took us long enough. We don't have much time left. And there's still one more riddle to solve. There's six blanks. I guess the letters go there. And the clue is... Swim up the Odin River from the Shibuya River. Then float down the U... Dagawa River and Shibuya River. Rivers? Do rivers have to do with anything? <clears throat> the Shibuya River runs under Shibuya Station. What about the Odin River? It looks like it goes under Tower Records. The Udagawa River is obviously in Udagawa and runs under Tipsy Toes Hall. And then it flows back into the Shibuya River. We got the E in Scrambled Crossing, the R Express underway, A at Tower Records, and the P at Tipsy Hall. I think I get it. You probably follow the rivers in the clue and put the letters in as you pass each place you got them. Swim up Odin River. I don't remember which river goes where. Uh, the Odin River from the Shibuya River then float down. But which... Oh, the Odin River. Okay, uh, so... A... E R Apper I think I'm doing it right. E A E R It's Reaper I don't know where we got the need to start with the R from the Oh no I get it yeah I'm just not good at these fucking puzzles Reaper 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 <coughs> Success. Yes, I got it right. And now there's a target for us to take down. I have to get us out the doors unlocked. Yo, Rindudes. I'm glad to see you're free and well. I'm glad to be out. Thanks, guys was not merely by our efforts alone, however. You mean someone was helping you out? So it would seem even a Reaper show us considerable favor. Let's save the rundown for later, yo. This ain't over yet. It's not. Didn't we just complete the mission? Not quite. We have to go to the Scrum Crossing now. Should be a target there. Once that's taken care of, then we're done. Victory is nearly within our grasp. Wait, what about Cannon? Gah. Are you holding up? I just got out, so I can help if you need. She made it out. Thank God. And yeah, thanks. We just got out a minute ago. Good to hear. The room bringers and pure hearts are already out and about too. All that's left is the target. May the best team win. Good luck to both of us. Mm -hmm. All set. That's set for scramble crossing. Cursed Croker. <clears throat> to the scramble we go, boys. Yo, it's that sleaze ball. You mean Kubo? Yeah, I can't say I was hoping to bump into him, but since he's here, there's something I want to ask. Hey, yo, Gramps! Haha, <laughs> well, well, if it ain't the Wicked Twisters. You spying on us again? Must be sweet having such a, an easy gig. Must be even sweeter running your mouth against somebody who ain't allowed to fight back. 
Just know that if they let me have a go, use wouldn't last a second. Yeah, save it, Grams. I want to ask you about something else. You're a Shinjuku Reaper, right? Maybe I am. What's it got a... What's it to you? Got a bone to pick? More like a pin. What the hell is this thing? Looks like a player pin to me. Likely story, but I ain't buying it. What you get out of bringing living people here to play a bogus game? Hmm, good question. What appear you call his bluff? Should have figured an ex-player like you would notice something was up, but fortunately, the finer details are above my pay grade. You expect us to believe that? Easy there, kid. Don't shoot the delivery guy. So the brass ain't telling you nothing, huh? No, but I got my suspicions. Could you tell us what they are, then? See, a hot hat like Shiba is gonna get bored if all the players are pipsqueaks. But he's got the room bringers. Ah, but one tough team does not does not an interesting game make. And that's to say nothing of the fact that we ain't even seen their leader in action yet. So instead of sitting around waiting for stronger players to show up, why not scatter some special pins around the RG and shorten wait? In other words, your previous lecture about maximizing productivity was essential, uh, essentially a pretense. Sorry about it. Then, what is it that makes these pins so special? Well, in layman's terms, it takes the psychic powers you all possess and uses them to transfer your existence from one plane to the other. Did anyone else get that? In other words, they send people with powers from the RG to the UG and here you saw. So you're saying we're hot stuff, huh? Compared to talentless hacks, maybe. Well, only know how strong you really are if you manage to leave your mark on this game. We've been completely erased from the RG. Even if we win the game, is there any way to go back? I'm sure Shiba could swing you did that for you. Ain't you running the male reaper after all? Meaning? Ah, uh, like you'd be able to understand even if I told you. Bold of you to assume we understood anything else you said. I advise, don't go sticking your nose where they don't belong and let the GM do what he does best. All you kids gotta worry about is getting results. And with that, I'm out of here. Yeah. yeah, another kind soul offering little advice aside from keep playing the game. If only it wasn't completely rigged against us. Shiba must be a real sadist to get off on seeing a struggle like this. Wouldn't be surprised, the Reaper's pretty sick, yo. Guess he really is looking for a team stronger than the Runebringers. He's doubtless grown tired of their dominance by now. Otherwise, I fail to see why he would enact such a desperate measure to find new recruits. You mean he really wants the Runebringers to lose? Sure don't look like he wants them to win. Perhaps then he wants to see strong Sykes wielders experience the disgrace of defeat. Really? Dang, he's like some kind of sadist. That's what I just said. Then I suppose the discussion has come full circle. He's right though, them Reaper's pretty sick. Wait, we're circling back again. Let's just get on with the mission, shall we? Make sure we're nice and ready for the final day. This is the place. Sends something nearby. Raptor boy! Bet that's a target. Bring it on. Those points are gonna be ours. Holy shit. So good. Let's keep it going! 
Really gotta be a little bit more careful with this dude. Got him. Easy clap. Tyrannosaurus Rex, engage! That's not so oh, that's bad, right? quite a lot of PP, actually. Fuel to the fire. Monocrow upgrade to the idol within. Kick butt, Yordi. Hey, Lizzie. Where have you been all day? Ha, ha. and stay that down. That should have earned us ton points, point, yo. Yeah, plus we kept ahead of the other teams in the mission. Lady Conan's doing, I presume. Oh, so you finally decided to do whatever it takes? Maybe you're more wicked than I thought. You again. You again. I didn't fall asleep. That sounds like you did. So, spill the tea. What did I miss? Why should we tell you? Eesh. I was just asking. Just another day at the old grind, really. Doing what we can to make it home. Really? And you think buddying up with the Shibuya crew will help? You seem quite concerned by our connection with them. Hey, I'm just looking out for you guys. Wouldn't want them giving you any big ideas. What? So you can brainwash us instead? You know, the last game already left a bad taste in my mouth. But you Shinjuku Reapers really make me sick, yo. Oh, you're making me blush. Oh. In my defense, you start streaming really early. You were already awake by the time. The wicked twisters wipe the floor with today's target, but the top spot belongs to the ruin bringers. <laughs> Same shit, different day. Here's hoping for something new tomorrow. For once, I concur. <sighs> this game really gets you down, though. No matter how hard you try, it's I was up and now. then I usually well, nap. Might as well just give up. Aren't you supposed to tell us to keep playing? Maybe. But you don't stand a chance at getting home either way. Uh, but I have so much to live for! So many games to play! Oh, Crabby oh, River. River! Can you tell us what Shiba wants with us already? Is he just waiting to erase everyone but the Ruin Bringers? It's me. Figures. That kind of info's probably above your pay grade. That was rather vicious. Think he got that one from Kubo. Ooh, the fangs are finally coming out. You're not gonna stop there, are you? It's about time you sink your teeth into this game. You either play hard, or you go home. Oops, forgot that last one's off the table. Later, losers. Shoka, are you, bitch? Didn't really inspire much confidence, did she? Still think we can pull this thing off? I don't know. Hey, did you ever get a hold of your friend Swallow? Yeah, I did. We talked. Took you long enough. So what'd they say? Are they here playing the game with us? Yeah. No clue who they are, though. Except that they're not one of us. I mean, I could have told you that. The thing is, if we do escape this week, we're gone. Which means Swallow's on their own next week, and you're worried they might not make it. They've always been there for me, so I really want to be there for them too, you know? I mean, why not just send them a good luck text or something? I know it sucks, but what else can you do? Anyway, we'll figure it out tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I hope so.
Oops. Friendship points! You. Shoka, dear. What's going on, Ayano? Tell me, how did you pass the time today? Huh? Is that supposed to mean? I'm merely concerned you might have been up to something dangerous. Nope. Can you look me in the eye and say that? Ugh, isn't once enough? Although I did get some exciting news, and what might that be? Oh, just that this game might be heating up real soon. Still a few things I gotta look into, though. I'll keep you posted. I see. Well, don't do anything I wouldn't do. I won't. You worry too much. Later. Hmm. hmm. What an unpleasant surprise. Come to interrogate us again with your ill-gotten intel. Who that? Who will she talk to? <clears throat> uh, guys? He's not moving. Motoy is getting his ass kicked. Hey, come on, brother. Stay with us, yo. Huh? Who are they talking about? I was not prepared for such tragedy today. Guess ah, today is another one of those. Is that time travel missions? Hope that wasn't a sign of what's to come. You good? I had another vision. Vision? Yeah, of the future. Sometimes they just pop into my head. Can't really explain why though. Gotta oh. fix what? Like a bad dream, but more ominous. What precisely did you see? I saw Motoy lying there. Oh, dang. Are daily tidings? Maybe that vision of yours got something to do with today's mission, yo. Expand your turf and aim for total control, or erase the target and aim for the top. Today's target is. No way. How could they? This cannot be. Shoka. Like our Shoka? I assumed Reapers were exempt from being made targets. Me too, boss. I don't believe I was speaking to you. Of course you weren't. Why would they do this? Think it's because of all that stuff Kitty Girl said yesterday? Perhaps her remarks won the Game Master's ire. Certainly didn't get on our good side. I worry our chances of besting a Reaper in combat are rather slim. And knowing this particular Reaper... There's no way she'll go down without a fight. That's even better, yo! Don't know about y'all, but I am pumped! That makes one of us. Aye, let's bounce, team! I know Shoka's a Reaper, but how tough is she? If that was her I saw in my vision, and she's at least tough enough to take down Motoy, if I can figure out when and where they face off, maybe I can stop them from fighting. <gasps> it's Motoy! <coughs> Hey, Rindo. Tres magnifique performance yesterday. Happy I was able to be of assistance. That was you. Oh my god, thank you so much. Tenata Sonor. Did you hear about the special bonus for taking today today's target? Personally, I think it sounds too good to be true. You might be right. Stay safe. Maserto. I'll do my best to keep helping you guys. Keep in touch and stay out of trouble, mi amigo. If you want your wet clothes to dry, hang them where water's in short supply. He's got a point. No telling what'll happen today. Better keep my wits about me. Neku not being Neku cracks me up. You mean Beats being Neku. Instead of Neku being Neku. So we're starting from Sense Street today, huh? So it begins. What's up, players? You're never gonna believe this, but you'll get to duke out in another scramble slam today, this guy again. We're gonna have some blistering battles, let me tell you. Because the Booyah has been split into a measly three areas this time around. Sitting tight and waiting for the storm to blow over ain't gonna cut it. You've gotta go all out offense if you wanna win today. 
And try not to forget about the juicy target, kids. <laughs> Keep it real and I'll see you on the other side. <clears throat> A mere three areas. That's not too bad, honestly. Get a move on, or we're gonna be erased. Yeah, I don't like the sound of that. One of those areas must also be home to today's target. Not like we're gonna have much time to look for Shoki. Whilst that is true, I cannot recall asking for your input. Just leave the fighting to me, yo. That's... That way I can leave the thinking to y'all. Sounds good. You know, Beat, can you smile? It feels like everything's gonna be just fine. Fucking close. It's not that much Neku-like, honestly. Stop the music. I don't... I can't reach that amount of time, man. It's just... He was trying to help us, no kidding. Maybe he's not that bad after all. Cracks me up, okay? Oops. Too soon, but I really can't. Don't care. I mean, I kind of like that they did it that way, but it was kind of obvious that it was Neku. Especially if you think about how Neku would have needed to dye his hair blonde. Nice one, Rin, dude! <clears throat> Why do you not like Nagi? I've heard some people uh, already uh, waifuing her, so I don't really care, to be fair. Personally, I was more of a cheeky girl, a cheeky girl, cheeky kind of guy as well, so just don't like her hermitness. You mean you don't, uh... <laughs> Never mind, I, I will not say that out loud. Tell me. <laughs> I was gonna say, don't you think you two are kind of alike with your hermitness? But that's obviously one not true. <laughs> and two, well, I'd get slapped. Let's keep it going! Move it, yo! 
Not according to my logic. Blend us your strength, your radiance. Let's see, reduction. As a hermit, I would ha wouldn't have a job at all. True, I holy shit, barely dodged that. Looks away for a second, almost just gets killed. Such a typical action against the one and only Yordi. Yeah, that's what I want to see. <clears throat> Holy shit, did I still get hit by poison? Are you kidding me? <sighs> Sometimes this game. Our party is equipped to win. Yes, got it. Not bad, yo. Bye bye. Yeah, yeah. It's time to get wild. Just not too wild. I did it. Hell yeah, you did. <laughs> Ain't no stop us now. Nice. How's that? Let's keep it going. Follow me, yo. Copy that. <laughs> I think we've got this. I don't like these burbs. Move it, yo. What is the question, Lizzie? Shit sticks, man. What's with these scorpions? Yeah. 
What time is it for you? It's uh, 0 30. So it's almost time for me to go to bed. <clears throat> what, what the frick am I taking damage from? Seriously. Just play all day. I can't play all day. This doesn't look great. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let me heal up slowly. Sleep soon, okay? Good night. You're only staying up all night. Nope. I'm not staying up all night. You know how incredibly long this vault will be if I have to stay up all night? If I'm gonna stay up all night? All night! No, 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 no. Lizzie has spoken. Poisoned, but we didn't get hit by the freaking scorpion, so that's good. Jesus Christ, not even two levels. Let me think this through. What to do? What to do? Is L1? Seriously? Flying high is a garbage. Kinesis one again. Oh. And slow leveling as well. <laughs> this one is fast at least and evolves. She's not square, so we can put that on the fret boy. Minamimoto uh, 
gave us the finger and was like, ha, I'm pissing off y'all. I don't need your piss ass weenies zeptograms anymore. And the blondie is beat. Yes, I was just as surprised as you were. Thanks, bro. Food. Welcome. Let's eat, man. You know? I am starving. Well, let's eat. I'm gonna have this. Tastes pretty good. This is fine. Do 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 do. Come back soon! Let's have a look. By the way, hi Dumpy. Let's move. How is life? was doing sea urchins For half the pins yet? No. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen. far we've come already. 56% done. Strawberry blonde Lizzie. My butt! Lizzie, stop calling me strawberry blonde. Only on thirty nine percent complete. Yada yada does he? Now you just dye your hair to darker color. Secretly, you are just blonde. Okay, tomorrow is Sunday. I'm gonna see if I can, like, go online earlier tomorrow again so that we can play some more. Because I really want to play this game and I'm having fun and I can barely... Like, honestly, I do want to continue all night, but that's such a bad idea for, like, my sleeping patterns and my sleep rhythm and... Uh, everything that I've been doing so well of late. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh nope. We're not gonna go all night. We're not gonna continue. We're just gonna go 
offline and go to bed like a good boy and uh <laughs> I will, like, continue this tomorrow. I'd like to thank everyone for hanging out with me tonight. I hope you all had a fantastic time. I really love this game. Like, honestly, it's such a fun game. And, uh, yeah, that's it. Until uh, the next time, which is tomorrow. Good night, adios, and sleep well.